You're listening to the AfterBuzz TV Network. Now the largest new media platform on the web and your number one source for after-show entertainment. Very good, From the AfterBuzz Studios in Los Angeles, California, and streaming live on Ustream, this is AfterBuzz TV for WWE's Monday Night Raw. We'll break down tonight's episode and get you all the latest WWE news and gossip. If you'd like to buzz in on tonight's show, you can buzz us at 424-256-1729. That's 424-256-1729. And now, picking up where the show leaves off and the buzz continues, it's After Buzz TV for WWE's Monday Night Raw. Yeah! Yay. Woo! <laughs> All right, Yay. Just, we'll, we'll get it off right at the beginning. If you turned in for boobs, you have four of them. Well, We're this here. is the this is the worst case scenario for anyone watching with their pants down. Yeah, it's like actually, this is literally yeah, the worst case scenario. The best case. Scenario. I was so, told there would be girls. Uh, I, I, we told you there'd be boobs. Uh, yeah. Guess. There's no girls. Sorry. Well, this well, is, this I is mainly awful. just came here to hit on Maria. Uh, well, she saw that you were coming. Well, let's let's do some intros. My name is David Legata, and with me is Jensen Carp. Hello, all. Uh, we have Clark Duke or Baby Jr. Baby Jr. is a good uh, name for him. You may know. Uh, t- tell everyone about yourself. Uh, I'm an actor. Yes. I I was in a Hot Tub Time Machine and Kick Ass last year. I did a show called Clark and Michael with Michael Sarah. And I got a movie with Eddie Murphy called A Thousand Words coming out in March. And, and, you and also, more importantly, you're, wrestling fan. And, you, and I am former Raw guest host. Yeah, Raw guest host. And lifelong fan. You're our Muppet. I am. <laughs> for the for the evening. And we have Max Landis. Max, hello. Hello. Welcome. Um, I'm a wrestling fan and a, and a screenwriter. Chronicle. Yeah, good. look up Chronicle is, after the yeah, show. And, my, uh, my movie, and then I, there are a bunch of other projects that I'm not allowed to tell anyone about. So. Yeah, that's usually how it Yay! works. Yay! And so, we know each other. Yes, we're, we're buddies. Yeah. You guys, you guys watched... cleared me, and I completely missed it, and yeah. uh, Nate Harris made it, me... Uh... Yeah, a big shout-out to Nate Harris yes, for looking so. out. He got you to Encino, guys. He got you. <laughs> Congrats, All the guys. way to yeah. Encino. Congrats, yes. guys. And Welcome. by the way, picked yeah. a night with no Maria. Yeah, no as, Maria, as no Lilia. As young boys from Hollywood, we always dreamed of reaching Encino. Encino. I know, I know, I know, guys. The secondary porn capital of the world, so... Well, you hey, got you got a, a Maria less after show yeah. and Woo! a rather crappy raw. Yeah, it was. I, uh, I you kind guys, of. You, I, how, I how did you, it. it was to, the matches were really good. Well, yeah, we'll, we'll talk. sure we'll get to it, but it's still overall. I, I, I like I was the complete a lot more. breakdown of reality that happened by introducing the Muppets to yes. the Yes, to which the I love. Anytime, yeah. anytime yeah. the show embraces the fact that it exists in this technicolor world backstage right. where characters live in places that are lit, that colors reflect their characters, yeah. and just none of it's real, and there's a midget universe under the ring. Can mm-hmm. we curse on here? You can curse. Uh, softly. Okay. Soft. Soft. So, you We're soft, a hard PG so, thirteen. Like you could say tonight's raw is shitty, probably. Yeah, but you, right? You, 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 I'd have to whisper the f word. Yes. Yeah, it's so really softly. mildly. Mildly. So I don't know how Jr. wears the cowboy hat with the thing, by the way, because this is really giving me a. Well, you can take. You off can take the off the hat. Uh, no one told Clark Halloween. we weren't wearing costumes. Yeah, so. that is. Yeah. Kind of, we <laughs> did ruin awesome. that a little. But I just I let him say everyone. he's going to a party. You're going to a party after this. That's why you're wearing. He's going it. to yeah, a big fancy party. You're going to the mansion. You're going to Playboy Mansion. Yeah, that's why I'm dressed like this. Hang out with the girl I'm dating. And yeah. he's going to the Playboy Mansion. I'm not and going to the Playboy Mansion. Being put on a plane and being flown to Saudi Arabia. Party <laughs> with the Prince of Saudi Arabia, wow. one of the 17 princes. See, this yeah. is far more creative than the Muppet Show. This is Clark yeah. freaking dude. Oh. See, good I'm for actually you. not you see, going to Saudi Arabia. Soft? Good you know, for you. I, I am I going to hang out with some Saudis, though. Do you want to go to India with me? No, <laughs> he's, going, he's going to India in like three days. That, that is something you say to a oh, stripper. Yes, you're, all, you're about yeah. to go. Well, in a couple of weeks. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be awesome. But let's not talk about that. Let's talk about the yeah, Muppets. Let's talk about, let's talk about, let's, let's talk about Rock. Guys. Actually, let's start it with uh, the big Muppet, The Rock. Yeah, I thought you were gonna say Ricardo Rodriguez. No, no, no. no also a Muppet. A San, Muppet. Santino also a Muppet. <laughs> yes. There's a lot of Muppets no, in pro wrestling. Santino's character's a Muppet. Yeah. I, also no, kind of a Muppet. I don't think Ricardo, even if he takes off the clothes, can stop being a Muppet. No. Nothing he does. Santino in developmental was that terrifying arm breaking yes. Sambo guy. Yeah. I mean, like Ricardo's always no, looked right. like that. Well, you know who doesn't always look like they did? The Rock looked 
humongous. He looked pretty darn big. With his bolt-on action figure arms? That was a crazy-looking human being. A crazy-looking human. terrifying, man. You know what I found terrifying? How long he talked for without saying anything. And none of us really paid attention, which I think is kind of a weird thing. The Rock, and I said this to, to Clark... They have The Rock coming back, right. and it feels kind of bad. He's standing on a hillside in the Hollywood Hills, yelling into a camera. That looked like do Florida to me. That looked, yeah. like, that looked like there was a view of L.A. behind him. Really? Was there? Yes. I didn't there, no, there, no, there are no hills in Florida. Yeah. <laughs> Just Florida, fake hills. Florida, Just silicone hills. Yes. Florida, Florida's uh, like my first girlfriend. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's the girlfriend you just yes. left. Well, yeah. you can tell when a segment was falling flat because we would start having conversations about yes. other things. Well, mm-hmm. he's better live. I mean, he, yeah. it's, when he's on tape, it's not the same. He's not even that good live anymore. The opening well, of WrestleMania. Well, he's still the rock. You were, you were, you were at Anaheim. Where he I was. For you were at the Anaheim minutes. Raw. I was randomly at the Anaheim Raw when unannounced the rock came back. And, I, and that was one of the craziest buildings I've ever Oh, yeah. been at any live event like that crowd right. was bananas. When the music hit, it was just like. Yeah, uh, me included. Like, like me included. I, it was it was electric. But tonight was not. Well, yeah, well. But well, when they you announced hear... he was going to be there. Yeah. yeah. Like well, they said he was going to be there. Yeah, it was taped. Yeah, it was taped. Um, but don't you think, like, the rumors that we hear about them having somewhat cold feet? Mm-hmm. Okay. Cold feet regarding what? Having Rock and Cena be the headline yeah, of they, WrestleMania. Yeah, they, they've talked about possibly oh, really? changing. Uh, I, I mean, it's ago. all rumors. I think that's a very... Well, it's not going to be a championship match, right? But we don't know. Who knows? It, I don't know how it could be. be. Of course it will be. They always mix in the title for no fucking reason. Nah, no effing reason. reason. Nah, they're not going to... They're, they're not going to... They put... Excuse me. Randy Orton. But you know that RKO the Rock's not going to win. You know the Rock's not going to win if the belt's on the line. You knew Orton You knew Orton was What if he wins, though? I don't, I don't, because you yeah, guys that's are going to hang around. I don't question the story. Well, I, I, I'm a big believer that it should be a title match, because if it's not, what's the title There's match? No, and by the way, maybe yeah, it, maybe totally. that's the rumor. Maybe the cold feet is because they can't yeah. make it a title match. Right. You know what they should do? Make it the Intercontinental title, really throw everybody off. Or the Divas yeah, title. Or the Divas yeah. title. Or the Hardcore Just belt. They bring, back, well, or bring back the European title. How crazy yeah. would it be if they actually, like, they could actually do that? Make it the IC belt? They could never, they'd never do it. No, no. It would never be the main event. But that's what I'm saying. Like, don't you feel, I mean, like, that was a rumor about the cold feet. Don't you feel it now? Yeah. Like, it's coming out. He's on tape again. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, we'll see what, what happens. what else is the main event for Mania right now? Who even comes close? Well, to, like, unfortunately, that's, that's, probably Triple H, Triple H Nash. Triple H, Kevin Nash. Unfortunately. Welcome back to 2000. Undertaker will come back that's for true. Mania, yeah, right? Sure. Yeah, sure. So that'll sure. be the main event. Taker and somebody. Taker and Jericho. HBK coming back for no, it? No, back. Who? So who does he I'll fight? Just Mark Henry. Ooh, I'm not bad. Mark Henry, too. Man, if they built that right, that'd be pretty good. Well, mm-hmm. what? He's going to beat Mark Henry again yeah. at Mania? Why, well, he's going to beat anyone. If I mean, he could tombstone Mark Henry, though, that'd be... He did at uh, WrestleMania 20. Yeah. What if he could do it now? I've heard, I've heard <laughs> <laughs> charismatic Henry? Sure. Yes. Charismatic I, Henry is heavier. I understand what you're saying. I get it. I, he has I more always, gravity. Yeah, I always, more gravity. I, I call him sexual predator because he was sexual chocolate, and then mm-hmm. the dreads, he sort of looks like a predator. Predator, I understand. The sexual I understand. predator, Mark Henry. Okay. That's, there's something to that. I'm sure he'd love to hear that. PG well, you know, t-shirt. also, the, the movie Predator had dreadlocks as well. So that's, that's, that's what he's referencing. He didn't mean like Chris Hansen, like because he rapes little kids. I thought I was talking about a specific sexual predator. That's a bummer. I thought maybe you'd been molested by a bunch of like Catch a predator after buzz too. <laughs> <laughs> We need to do that after Buzz show. <laughs> like the one where the guy comes back twice? That's my favorite guy, guy ever. Yeah. I like the guy who just like totally cops to it immediately and Chris Hansen doesn't even get to be smug. No, he's just like, I was going to rape a little girl. Yeah, he's, he's like, like oh, well, like, he, uh, why were you here? He asked him again. I believe the exact word is Chris Hansen comes out and goes, well, you got me. It's like the best thing <laughs> ever. He thought he was on Letterman. He wouldn't have the interview. Yeah. What a bummer. That's it. Just let it go. I, it's, it's like he expected like music to start playing and confetti to fall. We got here by talking about The Rock possibly being on exactly. steroids. Just, re- just reminding like you guys. We, possibly. This, this is yeah. also the name of my autobiography, <laughs> Confessions of a Dance Floor Predator. It's coming, out, it's coming out in April. My autobiography is actually called The Rock is Possibly on Steroids. Yeah, that's I a good one. I don't think he's on steroids. No, he's Shut up. He's, he's on is. something. You guys, that's a not human he body. On gamma rays? <laughs> like, <what? Super> <laughs> <soldier>? <laughs> he, he might have been bitten by a radioactive spider. That's not a human body. No. He was bitten by a radioactive Samoan. <laughs> That's you guys, he. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, I'll take it. His body is there's a wonderland. poor children. A wonderland. A piece <laughs> of John Mayer. Uh, if if you even have a child who thinks that's cool, I would immediately have a sit down with my child and be like, "That's not humanly achievable." Your no, son's just really into veins. Yeah, he loves <laughs> he vein. loves veins that look like wishbones, <laughs> like actual physical wishbones under his skin. Can you imagine how creepy that would be to meet like a nine year old who loved veins? I uh, this is way again. You can play your off topic thing if you want. I grew up with a kid who was like a weightlifter. 
And it was definitely was to mask five, other problems. Was he five foot tall? Because, yeah. No, because yeah, our systems about, detect uh, that a host has wandered off the subject. <laughs> that's fine. Please return at once. <laughs> Are we about to be elected? Our systems <laughs> detect. It's only because you called for it. Yeah. I, I did. Don't I did. Call I called for, for it. it. That's true. That's fine. Uh, but a kid I grew up with did weightlift, and it was yeah, creepy. Never do that again. Uh, <laughs> kid, kids don't weightlift before you're uh, before seventeen, and you end up being five foot two. Or really ever weightlift. By the way, this is the greatest after show because it's four kids who are like just completely non-athletic yes. humans. After Buzz TV. The exclusive. <laughs> Wait, this is this is. Uh, excuse me, excuse me. Currently, in training for boxing, three months. You're, you're the most in shape of any of us here. Former, yeah, but I mean that's like being the world's fencer. most famous can we, can pro we bowler. Not jump to don't conclusion. call fencing. Like I, got, I gave you boxing. Have you ever, have you ever taken one yes, of those yes. hits with yes. an epee? Unfortunately, we had the whole class in high school. Oh, Jesus, I, fuck. I, it's very serious. It's very serious. What but I gave you boxing. About? I'm giving you boxing. Fencing. I'll yeah, give you I'll boxing. boxing. Okay, fair enough. I tell you, I, boxing changed my opinion of wrestling in such a huge way. And we why should that? talk about wrestling. Speaking of wrestling. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. So we had Rock. He came out. Hey, he, Rock, has a, Rock, Rock. he has a not human body. He's not in a boxing movie. So right. we, then we had CM Punk Real versus Steel. Yeah, versus Mark Henry. CM Punk was wearing a t-shirt, which we couldn't figure out. Can't what it figure was. out. Someone tweet us if you know what CM Punk's t-shirt was. It was a was. Japanese thing. Yeah, yeah but I mean, what's the real? I, I want to know what That's the reference racist, is. That's racist, Max. It was Chinese mm, or <laughs> Taiwanese. <laughs> Why don't you just call it? Yeah. Just, <laughs> I was gonna go further. Exactly. So, uh, and John Laurinaitis came out and sucked all the charisma out of uh, Atlanta and announced that if Punk won this match, he, he sucked would... all the volume out of our TV. Yeah, too. We, we. Yeah, he. Was... If you didn't check the website, like ten percent do <laughs> watching wrestling. If you don't sit with your computer yeah. next to you, giving yourself ball cancer. Here's <laughs> here's what went on on the website. I That's just, basically what it was. Wait, you just pitched in a world where John Laurinaitis and that boy says the words ball boy. <laughs> yeah. That's my dream. I, I want to watch not, that my dream. You were watching. You said that. It's, uh, oh, I wasn't paying yeah. attention. He's he's said, I just, whenever he comes air. out, his eyes are just so blank. Yeah. I feel well, because like he's, he's so nervous. He's very nervous. I feel no, he's like very he's nervous. reading off of an invisible cue card. Well, he never stops for the audience. I said this last week, but he just talks through the booze. Boo! I'm John Laurinaitis. Boo! I'm John. That's why you don't hear him. But he does it in the backstage stuff, too, which is pre-taped, or like sometimes pre-taped. Sure. So no, ma- no matter still, if you take a hundred takes, the charisma is never going to no come charisma, out. There's no charisma, yeah. Makes me miss Adam Lay. Uh, we, yeah, yeah, we talked about him in the Adam Lee Jr. Really, actually really makes me just continue to wish, we were talking about this during the show, that Michael Cole was... You want to bring general, back the computer. The computer was a better GTV. I wanted the a computer. payoff of the computer. I still want it's it. It's the same person who was behind GTV. GTV. I was going <laughs> to say that one. It's the same Gold person as GTV. Oh. Yeah, Cole and, and who was driving the Hummer in WCW. Or blew so. up and Vince's car. Vince. Yes. Yeah, or yes. blew up Vince's car. Uh, so Punk Henry, <laughs> oh, yeah, Punk I would Henry. mark out so freaking hard if they, if they pulled all together. together. <laughs> the, same, the GM ran Nexus. He was the one. Who wanted, yeah. What was the favor? Didn't Booker T owe Randy Orton a favor or something? Yeah, a favor. I still know or something. Like, and if they just had an episode where they tied every single loose storyline together, book. it's David Arquette. All yeah, of them is David Arquette. Arquette. Yeah. Yeah. I wouldn't mind <laughs> as long as it was all answered. I mean, they were the higher purpose of Nexus and all of it. Yes. All of it. Yeah. Oh, Ministry, well, the guy. We did, we the did. genesis of McGillicuddy, it all yes. stems back. <laughs> Where David Otunga gets his coffee from. From that stupid mug. Yeah, that, we, we didn't talk. have that this week. There was no David Otunga. Ah, I love there that mug. There were no non-Muppet pre-tapes. I love that mug. No, there was no storyline advancement almost well, at all. Well, we can get to that and why. But So in this match, uh, Alberto Del Rio and uh, Roberto Rodriguez, or whatever his uh, name is. Estrada. They, 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 uh, <laughs> no, the, Mardo Estrada is not. Uh, oh, okay, right. Uh, Mark Henry, they attacked Mark Henry so Punk wouldn't win the match and he wouldn't get the title match. Never seen that. That one before because right. of the storyline I brought up. Exactly, thank you, Johnny. Uh, but he used his shoe. A disqual- like if you use your fist, it wasn't a disqualification. It was tacky. You're right. It was yeah. the shoe. I thought I thought what it was was Ricardo Rodriguez is viewed as such a joke by even the referees who, if the wind hits them wrong, are down for three minutes. Well, we, yeah. They have a but big the shoe, Iraqi the shoe audience. Is, the shoe is the shoe. Yeah, they brought. It was a callback. It was a callback yeah. for the Iraqis. Yeah, yes. I understand. So. No. DQ. DQ. Uh, and then we had our first Muppet appearance, which right. had a... Uh, Kermit. Wait, wait, you're, you're forgetting my favorite moment of the night. Can we talk about what the punk storyline at the end of the show, too, to tie into this? Or Yeah, we, oh, we'll, we'll get to the middle part. It's yeah, we'll get to it. Right, my right. favorite moment of the night well, was, was not shown because they cut away, but I loved that punk grabbed uh, Ricardo and was, like, going to hit him, and he was like, Screw it and just fed him to Mark Henry. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. And Mark Henry I, that, was my, that was my favorite we, we, booked we, moment of the night. We should have thought Mark Henry was going to eat him. So yeah, yeah. That, what if what if he did? That would. That I just not... want to say for the record, and I said this during the when we were watching. I think Mark Henry as champion is the the best book thing they've done in a long Amazing. time. Amazing, it's awesome, and the numbers prove it. I yeah. mean, Friday will, Smackdown ratings. Yeah, are, he will I, I, clearly I really destroy it. you. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 
I like I, he's believable as a heel, as a champ. Like the whole deal is great. Yeah. None of the heels right now are evil. That actually really well, Henry's no, close. No, no, Henry's none close. of them are competent. Henry's not except I mean, for him. Yeah, they don't have he's a monster. That's not true. Christian is portrayed as a loser who they constantly remind us is super talented. Dolph Ziggler gets clean wins all the time. Except for tonight. Swagger, except for tonight. He lost to but Twice. Lost, yeah. <laughs> well, I guess, okay, I guess I'm just talking about Del Rio. They Del- never present Del Rio as someone that can actually win a match. Since yeah, he won, they do since he's won, right. since he was the title oh, that since he's won the title that, that that first one he has not won a Well, lot. something about yeah. something about I, or I don't know, this the, I don't believe like He's definitely not untouchable anymore. Yeah. No. Yes. And that's weird because he was yeah. super untouchable right, until he yeah. won the title. He's going to be right. a big deal fairly quick, is what I heard. He was a big deal. I think he is. Did you guys? Do you, did you guys not know about this? What? There was an amazing goof up on the WWE website. Uh, Wait, the we're, we're there ten percent? So you're the no. only person. To take uh, I love it, it so much. I knew someone was watching. Do you guys know about Randy Orton has amazing thighs? What? You guys don't know any of the good WWE website stuff? You win. They, you, they, you they, read they, way they, too had, they had an article. This they, is super hey, tweet us. Hey, tweet us if you know. Can you hit the exclusive? Yeah. For this one? <laughs> After Buzz TV exclusive. Okay. I don't like that. I Man, feel the like audio is probably as alarming for the home viewing audience, <laughs> right? But it's like, it's like really out of nowhere. In your no, 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 no. I, I want to tell you guys this story. So they have <laughs> unnecessary <laughs> roughness. <laughs> they become pretty serious. To, to finish this, uh, <laughs> I turned into John Laurinaitis because of those beards. But no, uh, I just the, realized there's no reason for me to wear these. You guys, I can totally. Yeah, hear I can, you. we can hear, and, can and, hear and then we will have the screaming in our ears. No, I like yeah, it. Yeah, am I? It's not nearly as intense. No, you, you need to leave it on. Oh, yeah, I like. This that. is like how they get in your brain. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, it's uh, what it was is that they had a, an article on Del Rio on WWE.com, and then at the end of the article, after they were like, "And Del Rio looks to make a big impact." And then it said, like, Paul, is this okay? I know oh. this guy is supposed to be a big deal fairly oh, quick. No. <laughs> and, like, and, like, and it was up for like a day before they took it down. And so it oh, was total man. breaking of kayfabe. And then another article just had randomly in the middle of it, it was about like Mark Henry or something, just Randy Orton has amazing thighs. Just that sentence. That, I'm not I, kidding. Someone proofread it and yes. put it in as a joke and yeah, then yeah. didn't get caught. Because no, obviously if it was up for two yeah. days, no one there reads. By the way, when you talk about breaking kayfabe, they just showed the Muppets like, that's part of kayfabe. The fact that the, the Muppets exist in real world. It's the new kayfabe. The new kayfabe of we do whatever we want. Beaker was on Raw tonight. This is like Roger Rabbit tonight. But I'm just so happy you're reading the website. Yes. That's so awesome. I don't have to come out anymore and get nervous. <laughs> I don't read the website. Craig, I read the tweets about the uh, website. Uh, okay, Craig, Tello, Craig, Tello Craig Tello will be I'm very too happy. Cool to Good read people, the Craig Tello. Craig Tello. Um, all right, so we had Muppets. We had Miss Piggy mm-hmm. and Kermit in a box on the stage. And a great appearance by, uh, Vicky. by Vicky. Vicky. Vicky, the excuse and, me and bit. Mm-hmm. Which yeah. I got a text before we saw it, so it kind of tipped it off. But thank you, Sean Grandy. That was fun. That was a good That was cool. the best, I think, of all the Muppets. Muppet stuff uh, mm-hmm. yep. of the evening, and then the WWE actual Muppets. Anthony I liked yeah. I liked Cody bagging Kermit. Actually. That was yeah, that, that, that was, was also cool. Yeah. That was also cool. We had the pirate come out. Yeah, not Paul Burchill. Not yeah. Burchill. you want to talk about Paul Burchill? <laughs> I, I I I was saying that I think the Burchill pirate ex- gimmick. They should bring you, it back. If you, you know, had to, you know, exec- if you had to execute that gimmick, I think they did it well because yes. they did it with a wink. And he no, was really silly. But it wasn't supposed to have a no. wink. I mean, we were there it for start, this one, so I can talk. It started serious. He, it was supposed to be like Johnny Depp. Yeah. Like he was an Jack actual Barrow. pirate. Yes. Yeah. And you guys are upset was that the Somali? Muppets were on the no, show? No, we didn't We didn't come up with that no, idea. No, this was a Vince idea on the plane. Like, we didn't come up with it. So we had to convince this gentleman that he was going to be a pirate. He by was, the way, Paul Burchill was, like, trained by serious masters. Oh, yeah. Like, like, he's a serious wrestler. Yes. And then for him, like, he finally got a shot. And, like, who was behind him? A bunch of people. Regal. And uh, Triple, H, yeah, Triple H. And a bunch of people really behind him. And then it was like, make him the pirate. We wrote, a, we wrote liked, a sea shanty for him. He I sung a sea this, shanty. I, I, still, I so liked much. Pirate Paul Burchill. I enjoyed Did you like him, him when he became a drunk? Uh, no. I, what? <laughs> You don't remember that? That was, was a real drunk. thing. Yeah. It was a bit. I remember. I remember him on ECW being like, "Is he f- screwing his sister? Uh, what, yeah, the, what the hell yeah, is yeah, this?" Yeah. Lasted for about three weeks. More yeah. weird WWE incest stuff. Yeah, that stopped when they were. They should have had a there. Somali pirate gimmick. That I would have bought. <laughs> like like uh, South Park when they mm-hmm. were looking for pirates. Mm-hmm. Just like people would take over your your boat. There's just like three Somalis that come throat. in the ring yeah. and like steal the belt every week. No. <laughs> no, they're, they're gonna be Saba Simba. No. Do they have special right. music that plays when they come out yeah, to steal the belt? Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy though, happy yeah, though. They're, they're not. Like, they're not right mad. Now, uh, back to our regular program. Oh, <laughs> that's the Muppets are talking. We're on. We're on topic. All right. Where are we? Where are we? We're at we the are, diva battle. We're at the diva battle. Royal. Shows how little you know about wrestling. Oh, that happened. Yes. Yeah. That With did the not sexy costumes. Remember? I remember when I was younger, I'd complain because. 
well, when I was younger, it was also a much cuter batch of divas. But when, when it was yeah, 2000, wow. 2004 to 2008. Maria, Maria would be happy to hear that. Good, Maria, Maria and Lillian would be very happy. Yeah, That's Christi why they're not here. Christy Emmy, uh, you know, these are these are good. Trish and Lita, these are good-looking women. Hemi was um, really good-looking. Yeah. Oh, good. I wish yeah. she could wrestle. Anyway, so, no, the... Uh, They'd come out and they'd be in tiny bikinis and thongs, and they'd Sable parade would around. Just come out and paint and, and shit. You know? hand, yeah. hand paint, hand yeah. paint. Yeah. But they, then they just parade like around. And these Halloween costume contests, I understood they, th what they were trying to do. Yes. Now, when they all come out in like store bought bubble wrap, they were in the seventh grade uh, plastic mask. The yeah. girls at uh, the girls at Barney's Beanery in Westwood are sexier on yes. Halloween. The girls anywhere, anywhere are sexier yeah. on Halloween. That was a bummer. That was a bummer. I admit it. Uh, uh, Kelly last night on uh, Twitter, she put her "I Dream of Jeannie" thing. Dry, I dream of Jeannie, and she was much better looking than the pirate, which is how we got the, the weird, the weird pirate. Yeah. She yeah. looked like she worked so at what, Disneyland. So what's your complaint about this? Like there weren't enough. Like, we didn't have big enough boners. There wasn't enough to spend. <laughs> <laughs> we, we, <laughs> our boners weren't raging. My, this is a really sad argument, you guys. My, like, my complaint is <laughs> well, sadder than what we look like physically. All talking no, about wrestling on Halloween night. Okay. Was, excuse Fair me. There's nothing sad about talking about wrestling. I think one of us looks pretty sweet right now. Thank you. I think the viewing hey, audience—it's it's mini Ed Koski. I wonder—is is there a single? <laughs> can I ask? Is there a single girl watching right now? Yes. And if so, tweet me. If you have not dated me, in one I'm aware that, 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 that's that's a girl, aware. If you get one tweet, Hi, I will be shocked. Yeah. Aaron, I, I will. I will get you one. Aaron, my dear, please tweet. Uh, Do you mean single as in a girl, or, or single as in like she doesn't have a boyfriend? Whitney, I don't single know. Single as in she doesn't have a boyfriend. Danny, because her boyfriend is holding her captive with a gun, making her watch an after show about Rob. Yeah. I always, I was always able to pretty quickly. Because they're lying. Because they're lying. No, then lying. they go on watching it and they have like statuses but, about it after. But not no, for the I'm same really, reason as us. They're watching I, it for the bodies. Because I've had the same thing. No, they watch it because I <laughs> tricked them into thinking it's watching for the bodies. They're watching for the bodies. They're not watching for the. <laughs> I don't think they're watching. That's not a women really. I'm not dissing any female fans in the least bit. I'm just saying the people that we have to coax into doing it, which is every girlfriend I've ever dated. My girlfriend's into it. She like writes I want wrestling without me knowing. I'm just saying, I don't think. I think we have a tradition in it. I think that we've yeah. we've been we're stuck, with it. Sad. Yes. we're stuck with it. I think that they can go in and out of it because they're way cooler than us. Yes. And I'll get crapped oh, on for saying that. I, I have a whole slew of opinions about that. But regardless, what made me sad is that it was a segment that was a pointless battle royal that was bad and forgettable. Yes. Mm -hmm. And they were all wearing stupid costumes. So it wasn't sexy. It wasn't good wrestling. It wasn't anything a Diva segment could I ostensibly be. Yes. Was, the, was the battle royal... Uh, I don't remember who any won. Stakes? No, there's no, 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 there's no stakes. There wasn't like for a title shot. Nope. Or anything. There's nothing. It didn't mean anything. No. It definitely wasn't sexiest costume. No. A afterwards, <laughs> Robin afterwards, won. there was yeah. a showdown where Alicia Fox was definitely a face. Yeah, she she switched a couple weeks ago. Well, because she's skinny. Yes, that's what it is. <laughs> the, the, have you not noticed this, yeah. the skinny girls are now the faces? Well, oh, wow. sad Kong and the and the and the tough girls. Are I now can't. The, wait, I, I feel like honestly, when Awesome Kong left, the whole divas thing. They tried to put it on. When she uh, cried, how weird was that? That was a little. Well, I would never have done that. Oh. I would have had her get. You hit mean by a you truck mean by weird? You mean sexually arousing? Like, I liked it. You don't like I my love girls it. cry. I liked. I liked to cradle her weird. like a giant like, baby. <laughs> like, I, I wanted Kelly to like just nail her with a chair like ten <laughs> yeah, or fifteen no, times. Yeah. She was pregnant. Like run her over. She was pregnant. Uh, wait, so where we're at the we're diva Beaker, battle? That was a bummer. And then yeah, Beaker comes out. That's a happy. That's a yeah, happy Beaker, was, Beaker was awesome. Beaker wait, and Shamus and, was fantastic. And, and Christian stealing the potion, nah, 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 and pouring it out. Just Christian should have drank it. That would have been awesome. Would have helped. Well, we have a discussion her. later about the what was in the potion <laughs> and the discussion that probably happened because of the potion. Well, the potion okay. was that that blue urine from tampon it was, commercials. <laughs> it was, it was where they test urine. it? Yeah, where they test exactly. it? Yeah, I've never seen like I've never seen. Women's it was actually. Urine, but it was, I, my understanding is it's blue. Yeah, women's from, urine. From women's, yeah. women's urine is blue. Yeah. Women's, women's urine. urine. That's why they call it a blue shower. Hey guys, never. not to interrupt you, yes. but uh, it's ironic that the phones are blowing up on Halloween. Oh. All night. That doesn't surprise me. Can we so, put? You so, got Clark yeah, and Max. Let's, let's put one through now. Let's put one through now. Clark, yeah, sure. you are on the line. Hello. 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 Hey, dude. What's up? What's your name? This is Aaron from Virginia. What's up, hey, man? Virginia. Hey, Aaron. Happy Halloween. Hey, happy Halloween to y'all too. What's going um, on? Are you here to I'll kill us? Like <laughs> Excuse me. No. Uh, what's your question? <laughs> Um, I would just like to get y'all's thoughts on um, the Rock versus Johns. I mean, the Rock and John Cena teaming up with teaming up to face the Awesome Truth at Survivor Series. Well, before we give you our thoughts, are you going to buy the pay per view because of it? Um, yeah, I might still like try to get some like some friends get together. money for that. Okay. I mean, are you just buying it because the Rock's on it, or because of the Survivor Series five on five gimmick? 
Is it a Survivor no, it's Series just a regular final? No, just a match. But I mean, in general, do they still? I mean, I don't they don't they even, they, it's done now. Do it. they're, not, they're not going to do a Survivor Series. They may match? do one. But uh, uh, oh, my, my thoughts on it, we'll, we'll, go, we'll go through this yeah, quickly. Yeah, let's go through is, them uh, quick. Okay. I, I, I think it's interesting. I think it'll do more than it did last year. It, they got to really bring it home strong for it to be interesting. The thing I hate most about the WWE is rush storytelling. Yes. And I can only imagine what storytelling is going to happen between Survivor Series and WrestleMania. Oh, my God. They're going to run It's going to be so fast and so tiresome that I can't imagine this tagging up is going to make any... Uh, it's going to be great when you watch it. It'll yes. be fun. But I, I think it will make us all very tired by WrestleMania. Yes. Um, Predictions, I think The Rock turns on him, right, or something? I, mean, I hope, yeah, I would assume so. It's but not first in time, match. last time, only time. Yes. It's like uh, LT at WrestleMania. Well, uh, well, I mean, it seems like they have to make one of them into a clear, uh, like, antagonist almost for the story. Yeah. Like, they didn't I do just... that for Rock Hogan until during the match. No, he hit him with a he, he, yeah. he hit him with a car. I, yeah, I, 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 just, oh, I don't yeah. care about I was the there, Cena was Rock match. Yeah, the ambulance. <laughs> yeah, the ambulance is so memorable. I don't feel I, like there's any stakes to the Cena Rock match, well, so I don't none. care about it. No, there's I mean none. it'll get there. Except you don't that know they if it's for a title. It. Like, the, like the fact that it's a year build up is the yeah. whole stake, but not really. Yes. But not really. It doesn't mean anything. Like it really isn't a year build up. Yes. Just because you announced it a year ago doesn't make it a year build up. I'll tell you. I'll tell you the the second I stop being excited because I remember it really well. So I'm watching WrestleMania. And they have that ridiculous finish to the Miz. The Miz Cena match. Yeah. Why do they have great matches on TV and terrible matches on pay per view? Because you paid for it. I don't get <laughs> it. Friggin' Miz Cena. But no, I stopped being excited the minute that didn't go anywhere. The minute yeah. The Rock came out and screwed it over. And then his promo tonight is just more of the same. Yeah. I was just so oh, glad well, Miz was wasn't dead Royal after that was match. The when his match. Head what was it? It was the number one contender. Yes. Who won? Uh, Eve. <laughs> Eve's number one contender again? Yes. What? Do, I, I hate this show. Sorry. <laughs> Who are the Any other questions, caller? You still um, on the line? Yeah, I'd just like to say um, about the um, the Rock versus uh, John Cena at Survivor Series. I think that they could have, like, because earlier they, like, said, like, the Rock and John Cena were going to team together at Survivor Series. So they kind of, like, made it known. And with last week they said, saying that, you know, John Cena's going to team against a corner of his choosing. Like, we all know it's going to be The Rock, so I feel like if they could have put a low key at that episode at that moment, it would have been, like, big shock factor and, like, big, huge... Sure. Yeah, that was... It's always bizarre. You're totally right. It's always bizarre when they announce things before plot... Necessary. So stupid. Yeah. Necessitates so stupid. Them. It's the only people who like it, they don't understand they, how that they, doesn't they, happen they in any other TV show. Internet audience and then the TV. Audience. Even MTV, the challenge right. knows not to put the people who are up for eviction in next week's preview. Yes. Even know. they know not to do that, and that show's retarded. What's the challenge, pal? Yeah, I don't know. What that is. Really? No, it's Vince. Welcome to oh. After Buzz <laughs> TV. What's, what's, what's the, the challenge? challenge? Well, thank you for your call, caller. Um, Have a happy Halloween. Yeah, get us some candy. After Buzz. After Buzz. After Buzz. I'm going to take off my damn headphones. You don't stop screwing with me, son. Uh, uh, so where are we at? We're at Beaker, uh, okay. which apparently is related to Seamus. That was That's true. I that hope. Was, I, I enjoyed that. I, I want them to follow that up. With a buddy you, cop movie? No, five oh. months from now. <laughs> I want, you want I, Beaker to do a run-in? I Beaker did Beaker, do a run-in later. He did. No, I want Beaker. I want like a shot of Seamus at home with his family, like yeah. doing one of those promo in packages Ireland. like in Ireland. And just Beaker. But don't make there, a big deal out of it. And don't no, comment don't on it at all. all. I this is him with his family. <laughs> I didn't know that Beaker was Irish. That's, what That's true. He's definitely not. That's why you and, can't and understand anything that he says. Would understand. That's yes. a little offensive. Yes. Yeah. I didn't realize it was Irish. So. I want to say I think Seamus is great. He Seamus is great. is great. And he, like, he'll face whatever. Like He's he's spectacular. He's killing it. Did you get to interact with him at all? I know him. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, we'll talk about your experience here with the great point, but... But let, the next match was Air Boom against uh, Wade Barrett and Cody Rhodes. Yeah, Wade Barrett continuing to win. Yes. Wade Barrett and Cody Rhodes, two of my favorites. Yes, good. and they, they won the match. They, I guess, assume are the new challengers for yeah. Air Boom going forward. And we had our what first... What a clean. Yes, we have the first appearance of Statler and Waldorf, who were way below what I was hoping. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I have a lot invested in Statler and Waldorf. I know. I do, too. <laughs> Show how much you Vegas have invested. Show. I think I showed it last week. I don't know where it's here. I have, where is, you know where I have a tattoo of Styler and Waldorf. Well, I don't know what arm it is, but it's this one. Uh, yeah, I have a tattoo. How many of arms Stiler? do you have? I have four. Oh. Mm-hmm. Uh, um, Styler and Waldorf tattoo, and I, I was a bit depressed. This was also not... really too close of a camera on it, Styler well, and Waldorf. The obvious Shouldn't be that gimmick close. with them would have been to set up Commentary. another announcement. I agree. Well, I think they and then get them out fast. They get were supposed to commentate the JR thing, but that did not happen. How awesome would have been if there was like a tiny announce table? And, and they got put through the tiny announcement. Someone got put through the tiny announcement. Like like, no, like Tiny Stonehenge, but put but yeah. put uh, <laughs> put, put him through it. That's funny. I that would see. You could take the job tomorrow. And then we also, told you they could have had two small uh, Spanish announcers puppets too. 
That would have been just, amazing. Or just midgets, really. Yes. Or just Ray and... No, uh, no, no. Mu- Two Hispanic New midgets this year. Or Ham. That's what was that pitch? guy's name? Super Ham? Su- uh, Super Porky. Super Porky. Yes. Do you remember Cor- him? No. He was, we had a group of... The <laughs> I best. remember Super Porky. The best. Google the, uh, uh, the minis. Uh, the, not the minis. You, the didn't, you don't recall Court this Bauer, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Shouts you to Court Bauer. You guys were crapping on me. Like, you you, you started watching as a teenager. We were crapping on that. We, were, I felt we, just crap, we actually crapped on you. I, is that what that was? Yes. I noticed that there was blue fluid all over me. Oh, men poo blue fluid. Men poo blue Forgot to tell you that. Forgot to tell you that. Is that uh, what, is that what colors these walls? Yes. <laughs> I poop. feel like I'm in a Swedish version of the Matrix. No. Any woman who watches this show. <laughs> crowd like that. So CM Punk and John Lennon has talked about something. I assume it meant, went into whatever. Yeah, he we did. were eating candy. We were eating candy at that point. Know. That's when we were pooping blue. On you. It was. It was. My character's boring now. Talk about attention. your experience uh, when you did Raw. When was that? I guess hosted Raw last. I want to say March. Okay. I think March of 2010. Oh, during the guest host era. During the Here guest host era. Uh, the, I saw the Clark. Reviled guest host era. I saw Clark on TV before I knew Clark. <laughs> That's true. Yeah. Because of this? Fame. Yes, yes. because of this. <laughs> but only on Raw, nothing else, right? Yes. Just Raw. I had not seen Jackass or, or not Jackass, Kickass or Hot Dub Time yeah. Machine when I saw it. Mm-hmm. It was my first ex- uh, experience of you. Well, that's, a, that's bizarre that we're was friends now and we're yeah. at a wrestling thing. And my first yeah. experience of you seeing so, you wrestling. So you around. were in a hot tub with John Laurinaitis, right? Not Laurinaitis. <laughs> the hot. T- we we you were thinking a, of Kelly Kelly. No, we did or a bit. It just... was me and Rob Corddry. We did a bit with a uh, like Mark. Hint, like we were trying to get the divas in the hot tub. Like I guess I guess the angle was we were trying to like, you know, like hook up with the divas and just being like kind of, like sort of heels, which was my favorite part about it that we got to be heels. Right. But I gotta say, like I have so much respect. For I mean, uh, for these guys, like I, I did anyway. But after like being on the show, mm-hmm. it is terrifying. Terrifying. When you're a gorilla position and they hand you two microphones and they call your name out, and then half the crowd starts booing arbitrarily just because you're the guest host. Because <laughs> like, they don't know who you are. They don't yeah. know you. They don't. They're just like they don't give a shit. They're just like you should have walked out <laughs> just while you're on the rep. Shut up. Like, Shut up. And now Mahatma Gandhi. <laughs> <laughs> like, like, they don't care. Hitler's son. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, I, I, I like. And now former president Jimmy Carter. (laughs) They've booed uh, promos for charities. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, Yeah, all the time. They've they've booed. It's the most like arbitrary, hateful group of fans, and like, but I mean, of which I'm a a part. (laughs) I was booing myself. I I actually, I often just boo things to boo them when I'm at live events. Sure. But when you're, but like standing there at real position and then being like, all right, you know, like giving you the countdown and they hand you the mic and like push you out there, terrifying. uh, I've never been nervous. Vince gave you a hug after, right? Vince Vince never said a word to me. I, I have yet to ever. <laughs> well, we we figured out why. I go live all the time. No, no. I've never. I've he, never. He thought you were Ed Koski. He thought you were Ed Koski. Clark looks like WWE writer Ed Koski. Um, and I dress as a cowboy. Heel hosts, time. though. That's a good question. Heel why host. didn't they have well, them all be heels? Well, that's wanted... my question because Seth, one of our mutual friends, Seth Green, was yeah. a uh, was a heel, right? No, he's no, no. Who who wasn't. turned at the end of the match? Oh, it was uh, the guy from Entourage. Napoleon Dynamite. Napoleon, Napoleon Dynamite, Dynamite, Dynamite was a heel too. He did who was the guy from Entourage? Uh, Jerry uh, Piven. Jerry was a heel. Piven. Oh, turned. that's what I'm thinking of. Seth was a face. That's actually just his personality. Yeah, he's really just a heel in real life. Um, but Jeremy Piven, it was awesome. It was it was cool that he turned in a real heel way. I wish like. I briefly had a moment, and like, uh, like I'm friends with Dolph Ziggler, not to name drop you guys. The <laughs> Dolph Ziggler? The Dolph Wow! Ziggler. But he said to me after, he's like, you know, I thought if anybody was ever going to do it, you were going to do it. Just like on air, like when the crowd started booing. Because there was a weird moment where I thought about it, like, I could just, we're live, I could just go insane right now. Like, <laughs> but then it's also, you're so terrified that your hand's shaking and like... That would be so much fun to just be Kaufman. Just no be Andy Kaufman. Yeah. Well, just scream at the Cor- audience. Was Cordry a fan? No. I mean, he likes it, but he doesn't watch. Right. He, he was having a good time, but he... I mean, I literally... It's like the first thing I ever recall watching. Right, right, You know, right. Like, like my whole life. I so. mean, when you were backstage, did you get to see the guys that, like, uh, Steamboat and Dusty, the guys who were all in the back? Yeah, yeah. And then we were That's there. So cool. The Raw I hosted was WrestleMania weekend, so we got to go to Mania, because it was in the same city as the also Raw. The, That's the, crazy. The Monday Phoenix. after WrestleMania. The drive yeah. 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 Dude, do you want to go to Miami from... With, oh, obviously. Do you want, Tickets are on sale on Sunday. It's Sunday. Yeah, no, WWE.com. Okay, because I I think I'm I went to college in Miami and like no I'm, of course we're going to that I was gonna go this year but something came up um, I'm down yeah I mean honestly one of the <laughs> most I'm incredible down. incredible weekends of my whole life 
That's Way fair. off topic again. But no, that wasn't off no, topic. No, you were a we guest host on Raw. Better yeah, for your you friend know, I've Danny. I've actually befriended a lot of the guys now, right. and like, um, don't tell that story in the air. <laughs> and yeah, I mean, yeah, I still, you know, I still talk to a lot of the guys all the time. And it's, I mean, you know, for me, so, it's so pretty when, cool to like befriend so a bunch of guys. So when I call to have you back on to promote your next movie, you'll be right when you go with Eddie Murphy. I hope so. Yeah, Eddie Murphy. That would be a great one. Yeah, I. I could. I could. Should I imagine Eddie? Should I text? Should I text Eddie and be like, "Do you want to be on wrestling?" I'm sure he'd be so excited. Friends with Eddie. Yeah. Really? Are yeah, you friends well, with friends, new Eddie or old Eddie? Friends like, is stretching it. Fan, like, are you friends with family this movie Eddie or adult movie Eddie? I'm friends with John Landis Eddie. Oh. All right, that's good. That's, uh, good Eddie. that's adult. That's adult make, Eddie. Make the connection. That's yes. adult Eddie. Make the con- I'm not friends with Eddie because I'm a writer. Right. No. Yeah. Yeah. But adult no, Eddie. Friends is I'm very excited it. to watch adult Eddie. Yes. He's he's in my phone. I don't think that's After Buzz TV exclusive. <laughs> All of it that makes sense. What was the exclusive? Uh, that he knows Eddie Murphy. <laughs> that he knows Eddie Murphy. I, mean, I, I know him. I, that's got to be an exclusive. You were in a, yes. you were in a movie with him. That's exciting. I did, yeah. Well, oh, Comes yeah, you were in a March. movie with him now. Comes out in March. Nice. All right. Was that, not, was that adult? Heist, is that right. adult Eddie or is it? It's sort of a, a midway point. It's like a dramedy. It's called right. Words with it's, Friends. It's called A Thousand yeah. Words. It's words with Friends would be a good movie. It's going to go with the Angry Birds What's it about? I mean, they don't, they don't give a shit. They don't give a shit. <laughs> <laughs> I Google care. It. Well, we have to. We can after. call them after. They ask me in the car after. They don't, they don't care about this. All right, so we had our, our crossover yeah. main event, eight, uh, ADR. Alberto Del Rio versus The Big Show, which seemingly went for about 25 minutes. That match was 45 minutes long. Yeah. To me, yeah. I will admit, it's a shocking ending to me. <laughs> Shocking. The, the big, oh, yeah. show big Show just clean. Him. Not clean. He knocked him out. He knocked him out and punk That's came how out. Big Show wins. Yes. But against the but champion? I, yeah. Yes. I, I don't understand the booking aspect of like what yes. they're going for. We're not sure. And then Punk came out and... Uh, and then insult to injury to the champion. Yes, and he bullied threw, him. He threw water off Clearly water. bullied him. It gets better. Yes, he bullied him and <laughs> said, uh, I, will not, I will not let go of this hold till you say yes. Can we slow down and just have I don't me... understand how that's him saying yes was... Um... I think that's what happened in that John Laurinaitis pre-tape that we didn't pay attention to. Is it? He said. If, he if, says if, if he agrees he's to like, it, if I'll you could somehow trick him into saying it, yes. <laughs> if you could come out while we've already degraded him by another wrestler and then keep him on the ground to make him say yes, you got your you match. Know, I just, I, I'm just taking this off because it's like ahead. a thousand degrees. I right, actually, fine. I really like, I really it's, like. It's turning that. into a different show here <laughs> because uh, we're both wearing Western shirts. We can just pop these off. Oh, dear God. No, I, uh, I really like that because. Since CM Punk's big face turn thing, he constantly name drops the fact that he's still a heel. Mm. Yes. And never does anything heelish. He wants to have his cake and eat it too, and it's uh, Yeah, but I like this was this was letting cake. someone else eat the cake. I understand. This was this was him putting a hold on an injured guy in order to get something he wanted. I appreciated yes. that. And then his mic didn't work. Um, oh, by the way, was that a, was that a storyline? No, 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 that, that was, was just a mistake. He covered it well. Though. Yeah. He said, "You guys are killing yeah, me." Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Way, he ne- actually referenced the the truck in the back. We strong. never found out who was turning off CM Punk's. It was David Arquette. It was David Arquette. You can add it to your list. Manager, you, you yeah. add to your list of questions. I'm the anonymous raw general manager. Oh, we lost your microphone. Oh, oh, oh! See, the the problems have hit our have hit our show. Now we know who. Lord, I just cut my mic. What is going on? Mic? We're back Sorry, on. Pal. We're back on. Uh, hello, okay, hello, it's me, I told Max you guys. Landis, hello. We want to talk more about Eddie Murphy. Yes. Was it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Big Show knocks out Big, the champion, clean. and then and then uh, we have bullying, which they didn't run the bullying commercial during. You the can't show. do it right after he actually bullies. Them. I just yeah. want to say something. It's harder. Yes, sir. You were talking about like cajoling women to watch wrestling. Sure. Yes. My ex Danny dressed as the Miz for Halloween last year. I know, but it's still without I, me prompting. Her. Is she not wearing I'll a shirt? I'll tell you this. An ex girlfriend. How about you would have liked it? I'll there, take it this far. An ex-girlfriend of mine search is shown... For YouTube search Danny is the Miz. Every on time YouTube. they do a Ric Flair package, my ex-girlfriend, one of my ex-girlfriends is shown dressed as Ric Flair <laughs> in the audience for a Halloween Raw. <laughs> you guys keep bragging do you know who doesn't watch? You know who doesn't watch wrestling anymore? Don't worry. That girl. Yes. I don't care if they watch wrestling now. I, <laughs> just when you're dating, dating them. Little, little personal anecdote. I was going to come tonight dressed as Flair, mm-hmm. but I just couldn't handle it. Question. I'm going, yes. Yeah. To Max. Uh, Danny, ha- <laughs> spelled the regular way. D-A-N-I. Danny is the Miz. We have a lot of lonely men who want to see off her with of, shirt off. off. Of if up, anyone wants to start masturbating up to my knees. right now. Wait, she's, she's, she, just, she just keeps it online? No, no. I uploaded it because okay. it's freaking amazing. Okay. She wanted an entrance video. so Okay. Nice. All right. Fair. Your point? Oh, I was gonna come dressed as Flair, but just the wig and the sunglasses Bath robe. was and, wearing and, and me this, out. And then in this neighborhood in Encino, you would be. Uh, I, yeah, I would have been. Is a this pimp? A summarily raped? No, I mean it's pretty porno based. Yes. <laughs> If you I, ever wanted to film a gangbang, it's probably here. I bought the here. belt. I bought the the WCW replica belt. You did for this. Yeah. For this? Uh, well, for the flair, just in general. My so just in case it ever my comes up. My undying love of the flair. Like I, I just wanted to have it. 
How many, do you have as many ex-wives as Ric Flair? Uh, no. I've been using That's the term. That's impossible. I've been, I've been using the term "natching" in yes. real life now. That's, really? It's, it's starting out every month that you have to pay twenty three thousand dollars to <laughs> wives. I, like, like I'm going to Vegas next week, and I plan on natching one of the nights. Like the other nights, I'm going to be totally normal. I but, Saturday. By, by natching, yeah, is, and it's Saturday night. Is, is, is that where you just spend a ridiculous amount of money? Yeah. And then, flare, and then, and you then just it. not even woo! worry about it. And then woo, and then yeah. you stroke. Woo! Woo! Yeah. And then you just act like a I nature accidentally all the time in my apartment with my cat. Yeah. Don't even worry about uh, consequences Nature's or money or taxes. Yeah, just always be more tax. money. Yeah, always be more money. You'll you make can, more. You can always get yeah. more. Don't worry color. about it. Money's easy. It's not like you're in a business where your body will eventually give out. No, no, no. You can just keep it's wrestling like forever. Yeah, and no ever. Need. He no need. is. <laughs> did you see? Did you see him versus Hogan? I tune into the did dumbest see... show in the world every week just to watch Flair like <laughs> self destruct. Just to watch him be wasted. Why don't you just watch the wrestler? It's the same because I love Flair or the Scott Hall documentary. Oh, that was oh, grim. Let's not to be depressed. Okay, Ooh. so we had more Muppets. We had Animal as the bell ringer, which I liked. And it was such nice. a quick bit, but I liked yes. it. Yes, and then Jack Swagger versus Santino mm -hmm. with the first ever <sighs> Muppet run in. Yeah, the Muppets mm -hmm. don't like clean finishes. No. So we'll, we'll talk about this finish here. Is that he drinks the vial of, of liquid? Doesn't matter what's in. Doesn't it. matter what's right. in it. Lady it doesn't have any effect on him because that's real. It. But just so we're clear, that was Windex. Santino has just been admitted to the ER. Exactly. <laughs> the Muppets he's don't Greek. know shit about science. He's Greek. He thinks it'll solve everything. He just died. Uh, but uh, but just, I'm sure just the original. Tweet. You guys, can we all what tweet a hashtag R.I.P. Santino? <laughs> he died? He's he, not dead. Yet. From Windex. Yes. Yeah, Windex yeah. killed him? Yeah. Yes. It's a bummer. Hey, it was, the, it was uh, like the Kardashian wedding. At least he yeah. died doing what he loved. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> we, Drinking we Windex. He loves Windex. Trending within the wrestling community that Santino Morella is dead from drinking Windex. <laughs> That's a little I want to believe that. Lagana can start it. Exactly. Um, uh, so he ends it by uh, by <laughs> spinning, doing the Fuji. Yeah, the, the blue uh, the blue woman pee in yep. the face of Jack Swagger. He uh, was he was he uh, they used to spit the green mist. Uh, Tajiri. Tajiri. He's Tajiri. Well, yeah. Tajiri. Or the Great Muda. Yeah. I mean, the Great Muda, yes. Sure. Yep. So that was that and match. I started watching when I was seventeen. Good of you. That was yeah. Yeah. That's a lot of DVD, DVD history. All different color mists, and some of them He's do different things. Now. Yeah, <laughs> I am you look still good for 19. seventeen. <laughs> That's awesome. Then we had Zack Ryder versus Dolph Ziggler. Awesome this was a match. Great, great match. Match of the great night. match. Double pin. He got pinned twice. Yep. The referee's reaction looked like he had. What did I say? He walked in with his parents. <laughs> 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 Just a gas. Yes, he was a gas at his own had, behavior. That he got his foot on the rope. And you got to be happy though if you're Ryder. Yes, it was Things a good day for Zack Ryder. You beat I, the champ twice, and he's beaten no. him before. I, yeah, I, no, and this is guys, fourth time. No. Uh, I mean, uh, head and shoulders the match of the night. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, that was like almost a pay per view quality match. It was cool. For, it was, it was yeah. a good amount of time. That's, did no. I think there was a commercial break? His writers again. I only know him as sort of the goofy guy with YouTube. Is his history in real wrestling? Yeah, he's a huge okay. wrestling fan. So he he trained in Long Island with Mikey Whipwreck, and he's been a long long wrestling fan. So, All right. And then we had Michael Cole. And this is why, and I explained to the guys why the matches were so long tonight, is they obviously had a long thing planned with Michael Cole and JR right. that did not happen. So that's why I, the match I actually have to go to the bathroom again. Well, go ahead. Just right now? I drank three beers. Like, you just can't. I like, yeah. I don't think you're like, allowed to go, but you go ahead. I don't either. Can we leave his mic on at least? Yeah. We <laughs> gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, actually, there's a camera in the bathroom, so. Yeah, BRB. keep that was what, Okay, that crossed my mind when I was in there. <laughs> I, was like, I was like, if you guys really want this thing to turn a profit, just put some hidden cameras in the bathroom. Yes. Yeah. No. That makes sense. It's a different, it's a different house in this little block. Tip. <laughs> a little tip. <laughs> Maria Menudo. Just a little tip. If you want us to blow up, show my peen on your website. <laughs> uh, we'll, never, we'll never be asked back. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, Michael Cole and JR. I mean... Uh, it's just well, you were asking what why can they you do say that. though? What can you say about something no one's talking about? Uh, you know no one I mean? cares. <laughs> it's awful. Uh, it's 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 for it's the reason of two. It. I just don't get it. It's sad. Especially Mini Jr. here does not understand what's going on. I just see it and I'm and I just think, Good God Almighty! Where, <laughs> where, <laughs> this business is not picking up. <laughs> business is not picking up in any segment with Cole. No, no. Even my sauce hates this. I just don't. I don't. Do you follow Jr. on Twitter? I don't really no. I don't really follow him. He super breaks kayfabe. Oh yeah, he don't care. Yeah, he, he actually care. tweeted, "I'm in Atlanta. I don't know what Cole is talking about." <laughs> so <laughs> he don't care. I don't. I don't understand why. The, I don't get it. Like I just on a real base level don't. It seems like a weird. Like They're, personal vendetta. Oh, it's very personal. With bullying. JR, it's right? very, it's, it's, it's seems like it's bullying. Star. bullying. It does not get better. <laughs> no, <laughs> for Jr. No, it doesn't. Does not get better. Oh, we have our first person tweeting R.I.P. San Antonio or San Antonio, <laughs> Santino, San Antonio. Rest well, I feel bad. He died from Windex. Everyone should be saying rest you in peace. You know what? He died doing what he loved. Yeah, <laughs> he loved cleaning supplies. 
So where, where we have Cole Jr. That thing obviously did not pay off. They, but they promised it for next yeah, week. Yeah, because tune in next week for something we promised I, you this week. And that was that we didn't care the, about last week. No. I mean, yeah. that was the, the end of the show. That was like the money portion of the show. Yeah, they it's built the like whole show around it. And, mm-hmm. I, I just don't. I don't. I don't feel like he has the like. It has the right kind of heat. I feel like people just don't like it. No, it's just I, I don't think yeah. anyone tunes in to watch it. Not no, wanting, no not wanting to see it exactly. Not wanting to see it is not heat. Yeah, yeah. because exactly. I kind of feel like we argue a little bit uh, about Laurinaitis' heat. I feel like people want to hate him. Yeah, he's he's in a hateable yeah, world yeah. doing hateable yeah. things. I, but I do agree that when Cole stands up, you go, ugh. Yes. That's not heat. Well, That's just I want for, it off for yeah. nine. Actually, more than a, almost a, a year. year. Almost yeah, a year. But just on a real base level, it's really annoying watching them commentate too. Yeah. Like, like I just I don't. don't th- I can't. I don't remember anything they said except uh, J- J- or, uh, Jerry Lawler had some lines tonight. That and we depends. Like, I remember depends. Depends. Well, he had the diaper in his hand. He that was it. that was he, the payoff. We got him good. We we needed the blue liquid at that point. Yeah. I don't know. I think there's I think there's too many commentators. From, like the three men. Well, I guess it wasn't three men tonight. But tonight, yeah. yeah I, don't I think know. Max fell in. <laughs> he's Max he's playing a to the camera. Pretty severe drug problem. Yeah. <laughs> not, I don't want to make light of it here on the show, but it's too late. All right. Pretty, Do we have another caller? Let's yeah. put a call through. Do we, Do we have a caller? Can we get a caller? What if you just said no? No. <laughs> no there's no. Any, any Can you pretend to be a caller? Uh, I could. Um, I'm awaiting Lillian, so, uh, okay. Okay. so I'm we're, trying we, to keep the lines clean. That's fine. What okay. about any questions from the chat room? Is there anybody watching? I know we don't <laughs> have any girls here this week. <laughs> there's a good number watching. Uh, I haven't really been following the chat lines. Uh, okay. Let's, let's let's look at some now. Let's ask I'm, for some questions. I'm, uh, I just got a text from my mom. She might be watching. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, We have the camera in the bathroom. This is a live feed from the bathroom. I I figured that'd be more f- funny. That's good. Yeah. Oh. You figured right, sir. Figured. Good um, little thing. Oh, here's some tweets. There we go. Uh, a girl dressed up as a slutty Rey Mysterio. Thanks, Halloween. That's a good Halloween. Well, I like. I mean, just because she's probably a butterface, you can't. Did you see, did you see any good like costumes? Clint. Clint. Uh, this weekend. Yeah. Or were, were you too drunk oh, to yeah. remember? No, no, no. I saw some good ones. Uh, we my, had, a, we had a camera in there. Your costume, your costume cool. is a guy who will eat uh, a McRib at 6 a.m. was really good. Uh, yeah, that was a good one. That was a good costume. I also, much like Flair, live my gimmick. <laughs> <laughs> you, <laughs> were, <laughs> you were <laughs> nature. <laughs> a guy who likes to eat? I, I'm sorry about yeah. that. That, was, that turned I was, into a really I was, That's the Bastion situation. Booger. Bastion I, Booger. He I just, was commentating in the cab. Good God Almighty, he's got the cab driver ordering the McRib. He just busted this McDonald's wide open. Um, McDonald's is always open with the McRib, by the McRib way. McRib is the most disgusting thing they've ever served. It I has I the same ingredients as sneakers, guys. <laughs> no. There are ingredients you know that are is? the same between shoes no, no. and a McRib. That's crazy. The McRib. Can you wear the McRib as shoes? Yes. Because uh, I, saw, I saw homeless I saw, guys, homeless guys wearing, wearing like like plastic bags, so maybe I'll buy the a McRib. The McRib is essentially a flat hot dog, you guys. They took a, <laughs> they took a hot dog. <laughs> And they and they flatten. I mean, I'm serious. Like, like you're you not bite like, into it and look into the insides of it. It's the exact same. How is anyone convinced that there is a boneless rib? Is there anyone who's like that makes sense? It anyone? Didn't, it didn't work for Adam. It's it sure as long as going to work here. It's so crazy. Like, All right, Adam guys. In the rib. I have Lillian on the line with <laughs> us. Oh, poor okay. Lillian. Lillian. Hey, how you guys doing? Wait, you're, Good. you're missing a heck of a sausage fest here on the this show. This isn't. This isn't. <laughs> this is Lillian Garcia. Max, say hi. Wow. We have Max Landis and Golly, Clark. Hi. Clark, hi. Say hi. How are you? Hi, it's me, Max Landis. Hi guys, how are you? We're good. They're we're super, about, super. I was not there. We're they're talk- super bummed, Lillian. Yeah, they they, 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 they were kind of promised yeah. uh, females that they love from and wrestling. We were told there would be chicks. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Clark's in your seat wearing a and, cowboy costume. And you were just left with Dave. <laughs> yes, me and Jensen. This is yes. not a costume. Yes. Oh, sorry. He's going to a cowboy. Bar. How are you, Lily? I'm going to a leather bar. It's, uh, we're both wearing Western shirts. I feel so. We're awkward. going straight to a, a party. Straight to after a, this, stra- straight to a party in your car. Oh dear God, Lillian, save us! <laughs> How are you? Did you watch Raw? No. I sure did. Uh huh. All right. What'd you think? I, I loved it. I actually loved it. I think I. I mean, I had a lot of fun. I I was at first when I heard that the Muppets were going to be there, I was a little bit like, really? Mm-hmm. And they turned it into something. I thought it was really um, fun. Yes, we need more. There need to be it. more Muppets. There wasn't enough. I could have done more. What if, there, like, there was a Muppet character? That what do you guys think? If a Muppet character just stayed, and there was just a character yeah. on Raw yeah. from now on who was a Muppet? Sam the Eagle <laughs> should stay and be Vince. <laughs> Vince was a great Sam the Eagle. What if so. they made the anonymous Raw GM as a Muppet? Was a Muppet. That's Ooh, what if they revealed Pepe. it as Gonzo? Yes. What if it was Pepe? Yes, the it's little Gonzo the shrimp. Yeah, make the any shrimp. Sense. Pepe the shrimp. Yes. Did you have a favorite Muppet <laughs> segment, Lillian? Did I have a favorite Muppet? Well, yeah. I absolutely loved the whole uh, when Kelly Kelly kissed 
Kermit and the expression on Miss Piggy's face oh, was yeah. priceless. Yes. And yes. Dolph, Dolph holding Kermit's mouth. Or no, it was, uh, Jack, Swagger. Jack Swagger yes. holding. Well, my uh, favorite was when yes, Dolph almost started laughing. Yeah, I was yeah. going to say. I mean, that whole thing was great with Santino and all. That was awesome. That Even was the great. backstage and yes, I loved. Um, the the bit with Seamus and Beaker. Beaker oh, was he's awesome. Really- yes. Yeah. yeah. How would you have dealt with Animal as being the timekeeper? And is he? A, do you think he's a better time timekeeper oh, than Mark Eaton? Oh, I wish I would have <laughs> been there because I'm telling you, he's like right up my alley with the whole rock and roll. Yes. You, you, guys could, have, you could have been a. What was the name he of the band? Arbitrary. Electric Mayhem. Yes. Bell. Electric Mayhem. Yes. <laughs> you, maybe you could sing yeah. with Electric Mayhem. I actually, my, I think, I think Clark was right. My favorite moment was when. Uh, when Ziggler was supposed to be screwing up Gonzo and just started just losing his clearly, shit. Just yeah, he's laughing. Yeah. He's laughing awesome. about how hard he was going to lose later. <laughs> Lillian, what uh, what guest host do you remember most? Are there people that stand out? I mean, Clark, who's with us, was one of them, so keep that in mind when answering. <laughs> hmm. No, you but for real, for I mean, what guest host is the most them, handsome right? guest host? <laughs> My gosh, there's been so many. I just mm-hmm. remember... Oh, uh, right that was an top, easy answer. Oh, God. I mean, there's been so many. However, I loved Who when the best Jeremy lover, Piven though, I mean. was on. Which one? Jeremy Piven. Oh, yes. We, were talking we, about we just talked about him, yes. how he turned heel. Yes. With, yes. The, with that horrible... Yeah. What's his name? Dr. Ken wouldn't Dr. shut Ken. up. Yeah, Dr. Yeah. Ken, was, yeah. Ken was tough. Yeah. Ken was tough. Yes. <laughs> That's that was awesome. awesome. One that I did hear that made a... Um, uh, was on as a um, a host that I totally missed because it was recent. I was so upset because I was like, why couldn't he have come when I was there? Oh. Because I am a Hugh Jackman, like the biggest fan of Hugh Jackman. I actually, yeah, I liked him. Yeah, he, I was liked him. he was good. He was good. Really and good. they let him punch. Yeah. Uh, they let him punch yeah. him in the face. Yeah, right? they legit, didn't he legit break yeah. Ziggler's jaw? Yeah, he well, punched he him in the face. He nice did. one, real. No, it looked still. pretty good. It looked good. It yeah, it looked good. But he was. I mean, he's a stage actor, so. Yeah, they did that. I think they did, they did, I would have like, had I been there at ringside when he was out there, like literally, I think I would have just stormed the the ring. Like well, I wouldn't have been able to. Control you know what? Myself. I think I think you touched on something about good why moment, he was William. good. He's he came He's from stage the stage. Actor. Stage yeah. actors, yeah. Because yeah. you talked about the it. Crowd. Like, have you done stage acting before? No, never. So and like I, you were nervous walking out on stage. I have. Oh, I was I was a banana in a third grade play, and if I do say so myself, I was great. I don't know. I think I think you you probably touched on something really. Stage acting because yeah. it's it's weird walking out there. I only did it once. Yeah. And that's who you could find who? In, in New York. You could find stage actors willing to deal with the travel schedule. Oh, you were t- Unless they're like blue man. I don't man know group. what you're hung up on. Well, I don't. Well, I don't get Because well, I think that would be great. Lillian, Lillian would give a good, L- a good Lillian, answer. To this. We were talking about before why they don't hire actors to play roles. Talk about just quickly you coming in from the outside and what it's like. Yeah, yes, please. Joining the the road team of WWE and not being a wrestling insider. Yeah, you know, I mean, it was definitely something to have to adapt to, for sure. Um, it was, you know, it's it's not easy being on the road. I don't care what you're doing, being on the road every single week. I mean, as you know, Dave, mm-hmm. I mean, traveling, for sure, it does take a toll on you. However, just the reason I was able to stay there for 10 years was because it is such a high. Oh, my gosh, it's so awesome, just so exhilarating. Because you were on air, so, though, too. I mean, that's a different... I think, though, that it does take... A special person to deal with the whole not only the road schedule the the i don't know it's like a, a family within a family and right. and i don't know how to explain it it's just you have to really fit oh you have to fit like there's definitely a thing that they when they hire people that's one of the things that they take into account do you fit within like a family because you're traveling so much with each other and you're with each other sometimes even more than you are with your own family so you have to have some kind of um you know whether it's attitude or personality that just gels right. and and they and, so and they maybe, resent someone from the outside huh yes the, the outsiders are, are not welcomed with open arms like well, you talk about stage that's... acting uh, the miz they didn't like originally because yeah. he came from mtv like i feel like they'd be super intimidated and not in a mean way but right. you know someone from the outside world a stage actor i mean that's well with that said serious. Do you think they'll pay for my rehab since I, as a <laughs> yes. former guest host? I yes. have the same yes. complimentary lifetime rehab guarantee. Scott Hall. You have the Scott Hall law. Perfect. Yes. <laughs> well, I think one of the things is you, you definitely, if you come in from the outside, you have to pay your dues and oh, yeah. you have to just be patient mm-hmm. and you have to just, um, you really have to earn your respect, mm-hmm. earn their respect. You had a That's hard road, sure. didn't you? You, you I, know, I know you had like, you didn't, you were not, uh. You had a hard road to hoe that first couple of years, right? Did you say yeah, hoe? That's at first, yeah, David. I definitely did because I was the first uh, one to come in from out. 
outside the field. I mean, there was no diva search. There right. was no, nothing like that. So I was definitely the first one. Oh, God, and then the I was a female. Yeah. And then I was replacing Howard Finkel. And, I mean, there was just so many things that were against me when I first got there. And not to mention, I didn't even know what I was doing. Um, when I got hired, I found out that afternoon that I was ring announcing. Right. So, I mean, I told hey, This is I unrelated. So Why bad. did Hinkle quit? <laughs> first started. Yeah. He didn't. So, you know, having to deal with all of that was um, an issue. However, I have a lot of respect for the wrestling world, and I watched as a kid, and I think that that ended up um, earning me their respect and that yeah, I really cared are. in my job and what I was doing. Awesome. Lillian, uh, she doesn't know this because we haven't. I mean, I met her one time when I was right. riding there, and I just was like, uh, I think she was like, where is he from? And I was like, parts unknown. And she's like, thanks. Yes. And that's the only interaction we had. But we had parts the same. Uh, <laughs> Lillian and I had the same music publisher. Really? Yeah. I did not know that. Back yeah. when you, back oh, when you were a female when I was a vocalist? rapper, when I was a rapper, yeah, Evan Lamberg was my uh, was my music publisher. Oh you're the you're the rap you're the rapper WWE writer. I right was, that was me. I love it. All of my internet smarkdom is like coming to a head. That was me. <laughs> and Lillian was uh, I I went with uh, Evan Lamberg to a couple of her shows when I was in New York. And then I, when I got to wrestling, though, you can't. There's no moment to say that. There's not like we have the same music publisher because you don't even want to know that one of the writers has a publishing deal. Mm-hmm. Like that's not a good thing to know. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so so I hit it, but we have the same publisher. We have we we, we have the same friend. So Lillian, you back That's next week? That's awesome. I've I've totally lost touch with Evan. So if you know how to, I think he's get a big. I think he's him, a, Let me know. I think he's a big wig again, from what I hear. Oh, yeah. So you back? I, with I us? just love that man. He's awesome. Yes. So you back with us next week, Lillian? Or are you still on the road? You know, hopefully I will get back. Uh, I'm in Chicago, and then I head from Chicago. I'm here all week. Recording. I'm you know, so Max excited. will be here. I mean, Max is Max will be here. You uh, mean Max? He'll be not sitting in your seat. <laughs> okay, he's, well, he's a Mr. I'll be PC. Here. I mean, I'll, I'll be recording. Um, <laughs> I've got two songs to work on this week, <laughs> yeah. and then I'm heading to New York uh, okay. over the weekend. Well. So I'm hoping to be back in time for the show on Monday. Awesome. Nice. Well, I won't be here, so uh, I'm. I know you're going to be gone, gone, I'll be in, right? I'll be gone, gone. He'll be in India. I'll be in well Nashville, then India, then India, then Orlando. Three places wow. that are not uh, well, exotic. For the Just like my parents. That we exactly. were together, Dave. Yes. Uh, I, I would say on Afterbus because we were together for many years exactly. at WWE. It was Physically. just awesome working with you again, and yes. I just wish you the best Careful. of luck. Well, hopefully, I'll be back in LA every once in a while, so I'll drop in, and we can do Afterbuzz on like Scooby Doo or something. India's just like a drive away. Yeah, India's cool. close. Awesome. It's close. It's only twenty-two yeah, hours on the very plane. Very close. Yeah, it's not a big deal. Okay. Watch the parasites. Awesome. <laughs> Anything else? Watch the parasites. A, she's talking about. She's talking about Pauline. What do they say? Don't drink the water. Yeah, no, don't. Because I had a friend that just came back from India. Was. Really sick. Well, I can't, also, wait. I can't ta- wait to get really sick. <laughs> don't taunt the monkeys. I had a friend who had I'll 17 be, shots in her stomach. I mean, if you see Davari, just run away. Enjoy the burgers. <laughs> you to see Davari. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Get, get all your immune shots. Yeah, I'm gonna, see, that's a different country. Yes, I'm going to get everything done. So, Awesome. Well, go, Lillian, anything else cooking, Lillian? I'm just really excited no, because, like I said, I'm recording these two songs. The I'm actually working cool. on my new music video, another music video, oh. uh, next week. Cool. Um, and hopefully soon, Cheers. everything Cheers. will, you know, uh, be able to be launched, a new website and everything like that, so that the fans can get new material. I've been promising forever, yes. and just all the stuff behind the scenes work that has been going on that people don't know. So it will pay off in the long run. Good. Cool. Well, good. We look forward to having you back next week. Hopefully. If not, you'll be on the phone. So, Thanks, Lillian. Lillian. Thanks, Lillian. Bye, Lillian. Take care. Bye, Bye, Lillian. Have a safe drive. Lillian Garcia. Thank you, Lillian. That's uh, someone you grew up watching. Yes. Yeah, pretty cool. It's pretty cool. Yes. Pretty cool. I she would be sitting right up. where Clark was. I teenagered up watching. Yeah, that's oh, true. Yeah. Teenaged true. up. I just remember Lillian Garcia, my most, my most frantic memory of her is... Uh, who was it? Charlie Haas knocked her off the apron. Yeah, how did I know? That was I know. And that was seeing crazy. Seeing that at the edge of the screen and going <clears throat> like, <laughs> like being like horrified. Yes, yeah, it's not one of her be- better memories. A terrifying so. fall. Yes, terrifying fall. Bro- I don't think she broke her wrist. I think she broke her wrist. Yeah, I think she did. Yay! Uh, yay! Her wrist. See, Domestic violence. That we and where's Charlie Haas at now? Huh? He works at uh, Ring of Honor. Somewhere being a really good wrestler. Uh, yeah, Ring yeah. of Honor, right? Yes, yeah. and he's, yeah. I'm sorry I tried to take your hat. There's no way that hat would fit my head. My head is massive. He says you have this a small is, head. I have like a, no, I, I have like a watermelon for a, it's like a <laughs> seven three quarters. This hat will, this or hat. seven five eighths. It, it, this hat, if it doesn't sit Monsters. on top of my head like a clown. Well, we're not going to test this, it this, out this, here this on the air. This is great. <laughs> we're not going to do that? No, this is. Because I've got a question. Do we have anything? Do we have anything ready? Anyone on Twitter. Could, uh.
Yeah, I mean, while we're off topic, we're, uh, you guys want to take wait, one more caller? Yeah, yeah we'll do it. Sure not. All right, caller uh, 818, you are on the line. Uh -oh. Local. Some of my oh, people. Hey, uh, my name is Mike from Santa Barbara. Hey, Mike. I'm Mike in Santa Barbara. Santa Barbara, how's, how's you the name line? <laughs> hey, guys. So you guys hadn't gotten to the end of the show yet, and I was wondering what your thoughts were what on the Miz Cena match, specifically at the end where Cena knocked out Miz and Truth by himself. Oh, yeah, why does he need The Rock? Why does he need The Rock? Why does he need The Rock? Why does he need The Rock, yeah. Uh, well, well, hey, why does Cena need anyone since Cena can beat anyone on the roster clean easily? Yeah, he's Super Cena. He's not even Super Cena. He's beyond Super Cena. He's, he's a celestial from the Marvel But comics. I don't know if you've he's, seen Rock's arms. Some, so together... Rock, Rock's yeah, arms and Cena's back are, are very intimidating. Rock's arms are gargantuan. Yes. What happens? Is it is it Thanos and, and Apocalypse? I don't understand. This, I, it's, I think two, the safest bet... Are we getting into, like, Infinity Gauntlet? Yeah, I please, was, keep like, Infinity Gauntlet off the table. Because that's way too nerdy. It's just getting really obtuse, you guys. The issue, the issue with that, <laughs> like, the, we have no viewers left at this point. The, if we did have a girl, she like, was like, Infinity Gauntlet? Mm -hmm. I'm disgusted. We're, 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 <laughs> this, you know what? This, 90s this Marvel is, crossovers. This is, like, can we slow down? <laughs> 80s. This is the tell. Remember earlier I was telling... Do you remember earlier... Who was I, the orange guy? Adam... That was like Thanos's... Adam Strange. Adam this... Strange. Everything... Oh. Everything is about to connect for you guys. Are you ready? Yeah. Is it David Arquette? No, no. This is... This is... This is gonna... This is gonna do it. Yeah. Remember earlier you were like... These girls, you know, they stop watching. The, the girls I'm dating... The way I explain wrestling to them in a way that makes them like it, this is the the girls. I explain to them, I compare wrestlers to superheroes that they know because they read comics. That's but you're, but so, we're ta we were talking wait, wait, model on, mayhem. On, hold exactly. So, hold on. We were talking model mayhem in the, in the waiting room. What percentage of model mayhem girls do you think read comic books? The girls I date. Uh, again, I didn't ask that. Percentage-wise, what do you think overall on the website? One to two. <laughs> okay. Fair enough. That's not, not a percentage. It's one or two <laughs> girls. One or two girls. That's just a number. Occupy model mayhem. Exactly. Exactly. Understood. We're Understood. looking for them. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, no. this has been voted the most ADD episode of this show ever. It's pretty far out. By yes. who? Uh, by the you five folks. Right there. Are, you, are you with us <laughs> on that? There. No, but you're 100% yeah, right. Yeah, I'm on the ADD. Yeah, I'm thank not, you. I'm not enjoying it, but I just got to say Well, Maria it. usually keeps us on point. <laughs> okay, so what? Okay, I do want to talk to him about... Hold on, let me talk to him about this. So, as a fan, because you just saw Cena beat up Miz and R-Truth, are you now sort of like bummed about the match that you're supposed to pay for? I'm, I'm pretty bummed because, you know, I'm already buying Cena and Rock as the dominant force, so to me, you've got to build up Miz and Truth to tell me that this is going right. to be anything but a complete swash on the Cena Rock end. But let, me, but let me play devil's advocate. Are you tuning in to see the Mega Powers break up? No, because I already know they're going to break up. So the Mega the Powers didn't break, break up their first match. Not like, you know, exactly the market they're going for, but yeah, what at the same buy? time, what? it's plainly obvious. I agree. Like, I, I'm not sure what people are buying. Attention. I guess people are buying that, that waiting to see them you know break what up. I would buy? You know, the only the only legit storyline they could do with Cena right now is have him go against Mark Henry. And yeah. have Mark and Henry beat him. beat him. And have Mark him. Henry beat him. Yeah. That'd be great. I loved one of my favorite moments in wrestling in recent history is that moment when Randy Orton went for the RKO yes. and couldn't yeah, get it. Yeah. Him off. And then, and nice. then tried it again, and Mark Henry just looked at him and said no. Yeah. Yelled some prison shit at him. <laughs> <laughs> prison rules. You feel that in real... that pocket? That's my hand! <laughs> some real, some real Mavita loco. I love every yeah. time Mark Henry yells random bullshit. Yeah. His dialogue is probably written by the same guys who did The Wire. Come in my house and eat my celery! <laughs> See my celery! People yeah. running up the street waving celery in yeah. my face, not you! And yeah. then he beats the crap out of He's someone. He's killing it right now, man. Yeah. He's killing yeah. awesome. So yeah, like, I don't know what people are buying. Um, the pay-per-view for. Yeah, I mean, it's, 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 it's almost Spirit Squad versus DX. Yeah, it's exactly right. what it's it exactly is. It's exactly what it is. So. All right. Well, thank you, caller. Any other Thanks, questions? Thanks, man. I like that call. Are you good? You're in Santa Barbara, so you're excellent. Thank you very much, guys. How's Halloween in Santa Barbara? Is it crazy? It's great. That College Street. Are you on that tonight? Yeah, are you out looking at <laughs> people? He's obviously not on it. Yeah, he's calling us. Call on us. Wait, hold on. What? No, I gotta work. Oh, uh, State... Uh, is it, what's it called? State... What is it called? State Street. State Street, oh, right? Uh, Street, yeah. There I mean, are one right by the college definitely so crazy fire. things going on there. So you're at work watching us. You own Gallery 1988? I do. Yes. You, Thank you, caller. You, you, you're cool. Thank you. Thanks, man. He uh, cool. Okay, wait, we're, uh, we're on the main yeah, event. Yeah, we're at the main event, which we just talked about. Yeah. That was, are that there was the more, main event. Are there more people trying to call? Yes. I'm That's, sure. Are the lines just stacked? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's Imus, is he still on the air? And there's Stern, and then there's uh, Kevin We, have Imus, we should that. say something they, racist to get controversy yes, going. Yeah. They, they were uh, going off the charts, and now uh, now it's kind of slowed down. People, well, people have fallen asleep. We'll take some calls. We should every yeah. call. Just we're, we're, we're getting to the, yeah, to we, the we final a, segment. Yeah, we'll we, take some calls. Yes, because uh, I don't have any news. We have yeah. segments. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, <there's laughs> a, let me, uh, that was really Imus, by the way. 
All right, yeah. here we go. All right, okay. we, we got, got somebody. Okay, six four one number. Four okay. one. Four one. Oh, it's international. International. Six four one. Oh, six oh, four oh, one. Oh. Hello. Hello. Mom. Hello. Hey, man. What's your name? What's up? Um, I'm Ian from Iowa. Hey, Ian. What's going oh, on in whoa. Iowa? Not a whole lot. They know. sold Field of Dreams. I actually, I actually was the one that won that uh, contest. That oh. Was from that uh, Mr. P. Had. Did he send it to you yet? Uh, what? Did he send it to you? Did you get your prize yet? Uh, no, he hasn't sent it to me yet. I think he was going to wait and have everyone sign it, though. Well, no, uh-huh. nobody's here except me, so uh, yeah. Yeah, and he took it with him. I noticed that. He didn't want to sit next to Clark, know. so he didn't, he didn't well, I don't know what we're referencing right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so, what, so what, what's your question? What's your question? Yeah. Um, I was just going to comment on you know your whole t- thing about uh, The Rock and the scene. Oh, like, yeah, yeah. Really what, what did I he say? I thought it was going to be like your show. I know. I just wanted to say a word about these guests this week. You guys suck. Freaking Hollywood come I, in, think they can guys. say whatever they want. I don't, I don't see the uh, the draw there. I mean, are you going to buy? Get everybody to, you know, get pumped up for WrestleMania, and you're just doing this. It's are you, are you going to are you going to buy the pay per view? No, I'm not actually. Are you going to stream it? Are we going to Are we going to watch it? No. I'm. I'm probably just going to listen to uh, you know listen to one of my friends. Oh, I, was, I, I would listen to like old school like Scramble Vision <laughs> hey, on AM radio. <laughs> like, this is about radio. to pick up. You don't know what it is, but it's picking up. Is there a radio broadcast of wrestling? <laughs> <laughs> no, there used to be. <laughs> there was. No, yeah. I was a kid on Scramble Vision. Like before there was digital cable boxes, you just would yeah. go to the channel and I, you could listen I to I the events. That, yeah. I would listen to WrestleMania yeah. Seven oh that way. And then every, like when Kane would go his pyro off, like red for some reason made the picture go clear. One of the funniest stories yeah. I've ever heard is. Roddy Piper told me this that on the first Wrestlemania there were odds in Vegas on it you could gamble on it mm-hmm. and I go why aren't you all billionaires <laughs> yeah. like, what <laughs> what <laughs> That is true. Why would you not bet about, all like, over it? When K-Fake still exists, yeah. you can, yeah. there's some places that still bet on it. But why are not you and everyone you know <laughs> billionaires, dude? That's a, that's a great. I assume that's there's. A, I think there's a limit because I looked into it. Maybe when I worked there, you just can make five dollars. Yeah. You can only make five dollars. I think it's like you can only bet a hundred dollars. Yeah, well, but still, you should you have a bunch of hundred dollar bills. You, you didn't have. Right? I mean, that's true. What's you that? Can't, you can't all right, guys. Yes, we can. have uh, this caller has been trying all night, so we um, have to take him. Okay. 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 Hello. Her? Come on. It's not a girl. Hey it's uh, not a girl. Hello, <laughs> hello ma'am. <laughs> it's not a girl. I'm begging for a girl. Hey, man. What's your name? Hello? Hey, guys. Hi. Um, it's uh, Bill from Staten Island. What's going hey, Bill. on, Bill? Hey, Bill. What are you wearing, Bill? How's the snow? Hey, um, Something I have warm. to say that I was completely distracted by The Rock's beard. Oh, I gray know. beard! Yeah, yeah. Just for men! Just, Lord just gray beard. Men. It was so Keith Hernandez. I agree with you. His uh, beard looks weird. Yep. His beard did look weird. <laughs> Do you think it's part of a... <laughs> How awesome would it be if they if they give him the uh, the awesome truth that move they do the combo move and then just for men him in the middle? That's of what's gonna happen. In it's the, the two new weeks. the new NWO <laughs> is to just for men. Just for men. <laughs> do you think uh, Do you think that it was part of a role? I, 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 I have it. I have it. It's the Rock from the future. It's ten years later. <laughs> so That's why is he had those robot time. arms. The yeah. Rock's new gimmick is he's Cable from X Men. What is it? Uh, we have another reference. That's why he had those yeah. arms. Yeah. Because he's Cable from X Men. He's gonna peel metal off. Yeah. Oh, that's pretty awesome. Um, do you uh, do you think that's possibly why he has robot body? I mean, that's got to be the yeah. whole. He's like future Biff Tannen. Yeah. 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 He has sports yeah. almanac in him. No, that we, that's, that's our Cable reference yeah. that went way over your head. I don't know Cable. Is that, that X Force? I'm cable, getting denied. Yeah. Yeah, I'm I getting denied. I, knew, no, I got yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Everybody, I'm getting denied live for the. There we go. There I got we it. The last girl just tuned out. Yes. Please, oh, yeah, any I woman would, call in. I mean, I think I think probably The Rock is going to play the heel to the time to get to WrestleMania. No, I don't believe no it. Way. I don't believe it. I think Miami, both of no them way. are good he, guys. He's going to go in the Hall of Fame. You know yeah. what I mean? There's no way that The Rock... They, he could kidnap babies and line them up, and the people will still hate John Cena. I agree with you. I think that that would be the bet, but there's there's no way they're going to no, do they it. Can yeah. try, it's it's kind of like when Mayweather, they tried to make him the good guy. You know what I mean? Like he, People just don't like... Didn't he come out in Vegas? Yeah, no chance. Yeah, everyone loves him. He yeah. owns Vegas, but not no. But I love the WrestleMania match. Can yeah. we? Can I say during the me- WrestleMania match? I love the Big Show Mayweather yeah. WrestleMania match. Probably my favorite book match of all time. What? Yeah, it just because That's a bold statement. <laughs> that is a no, bold I, because statement. Because a Steamboat bold Flair. Don't know if you watched <laughs> Snuka <laughs> at the Garden. No, 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 no. no, no. I'm not talking my favorite wrestled match. Uh, I'm okay. not talking my favorite emotional a special match. attraction. But match. The, fa- the fact that it was a special attraction, but they that Mayweather let it be known. That if he's in the ring alone with the Big Show, he will be killed. 
that that was part of the angle. Yes, that right. he'll just be killed. Oh, and the, the punch fact, was great. Yeah, that was a good punch. the punch was great. But the fact that they saw that Mayweather let his ego aside to yeah. be a little guy against mm -hmm. a giant yeah. guy. That's special, and I, I really like the way it played Wait, out. I just and this is just because I don't remember. Was that the genesis of the the Big Show's punch? Punch, yeah, yeah that is. Yeah, that punch, is. Yes. yeah, yes, that is. I mean, he did I forgot that. break a face. Yes. <laughs> like, well, back crazy. on our ADD theme. Uh, we're, we're, what was your? Do you have another question, caller? Are you still there? Do we hang up on you? Well, no, no, no. I'm, I'm, okay. I'm slow around, man. I'm just. Um, you guys are having a great time, and I'm yeah. appreciating watching. The Thanks, show. man. Awesome. Hey, are, are yeah. you? Uh, are, did we ask him if he's watching the pay per view? Or did, are you? Are you buying the pay per view or not? Um, no, because actually I have to admit, never, never, even in his height, and even in his, uh, popular, in his height's popularity, never really been a rock fan. Wow. Oh, wow. What? Wow. Ne <laughs> what? Ne never really been. Wow. It's, always, it's always seemed to me that he's always been, always playing the bully character, just right. never, just not into wow. it. Who did you pick? You kind of have to pick another person. Who was like Who's your, your guy? Yeah. Wait, um, wait uh, who's my favorite? Who's yeah, your favorite not, not like, in you the dating, rock era? Who, are you, who, are you buy, like, who did you buy pay-per-view for? Who's your man? <laughs> oh, no, no, I, 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 would, I wouldn't buy a pay-per-view for, uh, for Rock or Cena. No, no, no but, but, who, but who's in that your era, guy? Who, yeah, like, who's your favorite? Favorite? You had to pick another person. Matt who, Hardy. Who's your guy? <laughs> he was mine for a while. Um, I love I love. Would you want to date him? You just said we didn't have to date him. Would you let him put his hand in your back pocket? I'd let him make one of those weird YouTube videos for me. Those things are creepy. So, did you have somebody that you would like want to like? Did you buy a T-shirt for anybody? Who's your guy? Um, punk. Punk. Okay. Cool. All right. Fair enough. Cool. Well, punk, thanks for the uh, call. I been, think been, uh, been a fan since Ring of Honor. Oh. Been now. Thank well, you very go, much. Yeah. Appreciate cool. it. Awesome. Come to India Thank with me. Uh, <laughs> I think. <laughs> I think. Punk, Thank you, caller. Punk, thanks, man. You could make a an analog between punks turning from heel to face just by virtue of being so awesome. Yeah. By I mean, with the way the rock, rock and, and Stone Cold, Cold. and Stone right. Cold, yeah. But everything's so accelerated I know. now, well, so fast. I haven't seen over a year. I haven't seen Jensen since Comic Con. Has that been seventy-two days, or is it shorter? <laughs> I mean, it feels like a Kardashian wedding. Yeah, I mean, uh, it's like from when we were so cool. excited at Comic Con. With the, that was the he came the, to Comic Con. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah. it was so fun he and so by, yeah, he stopped, stopped by, by her, his place. So fun, so exciting, and uh, I mean, that was what May. No, that was July. July, July twentieth. Uh, and I would say ago. by end of August, his storyline was blown apart. Oh yeah. Right? Hey, how did how did CM Punk versus the establishment become Kevin freaking Nash versus Triple H? Well, because Triple H made himself against the establishment. Oh, it's so embarrassing the writing because it's so the transparently about ego. They only have Nash on every like three weeks. Yeah, like they weren't even. Mm -hmm. on, I, I, didn't, oh, yeah. I I didn't even take note that they just sort they of played a package. Yeah. And that was a big deal that started the three, show. And they did three talk, replays last week. And they didn't talk about it till three quarters during the show. So it's, yeah. if it's not important in the TV show, then it's not important to the audience yeah. because we all forgot about it. Oh yeah, that happened. Yeah. So that stinks. That was Stinksville. Oh, I'm I just I'm so confused by the fact that I Nash think is still around. How great would it have been? Remember when when Miz and R Truth came in in the black hoodies? Oh, and well, face we mask? talked about this. They should have just pulled NWO shirts off. Yeah, they should have just NWO, done it. Yeah. and they should have spray like, painted it in the middle of the ring. Then Nash comes out and joins them. Give yeah. Nash a reason to be there. Who else is in your NWO? That's a fun game. Just them. Just those Nash, three guys. Uh, Miz, that's and Truth. strong enough. Just, sure. just them, and, and the way that is the Conan way that, in it, and Rick Steiner, <laughs> Conan, 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 they bring Conan. in. Yeah, we need Horace Hogan. Horace Hogan oh. will come no, in. No, and then and then Virgil, <laughs> Virgil, Virgil, and then I, but like Virgil's really my driver. He's <laughs> oh Jesus, <laughs> He's, he drove me here. He's out in the car. That actually, that storyline's my big letdown. By the way, when I ever get enough money to have a full time driver, I'm naming hiring, him Virgil. No, no, I'm hiring Virgil. <laughs> yeah, he does He's always a Comic Con. Yeah, every he's always signing a Comic Con. That picture, you guys have seen that. Picture Virgil wrestling superstar. I can pay yeah. him hundred grand a year. Right. Do you think he'd? Be, you think he'd yeah. drive me? Yeah. Oh, hundred percent. And he never gets to wear sleeves, ever. Okay. And he's he, like, by the way, he one hundred percent will do that. I think this is a great Kickstarter every, campaign. This is a great Kickstarter. <laughs> to raise this is a great grand to yeah, hire Virgil. Just to hire Virgil. And by the way, uh, let's 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 pretend he's never going to hear this. Hundred grand's a little high, sir. You let's, get like oh. he'd probably get him seventy five or sixty. Sixty-two five. Sixty dollars. Sixty McRibs. Dollars. Sixty McRibs. I'm just saying, can you imagine like the one out of every like thirty-five people that would be like, is that <laughs> the, the the amount of girls that, who would not know who that is? Is that the guy from is? Hot Tub Time Machine? Is he being driven around by Virgil <laughs> from the WWF? <laughs>
<laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> that someone's at some mom in Nebraska. This is my dream, that. though. This is my like. Well, this is my like. Dream big kid. Dream just big roll, kid. roll into Soho House have, and have uh, <laughs> Virgil standing at the table behind you. He pays all your bar tabs. Yeah. Like you're like hand him and he. He's got to go with me everywhere. I yeah, mean, obviously. I can get my ass kicked at the drop of a hat. He's got to be there to. <laughs> he's got to be the pizza guy. Glad you're outside. Yo, yeah. you're. Ca- by the way, yeah. that Kickstarter is really funny. We're gonna do that kick. If I, oh, someone oh, set up that Kickstarter, that's really funny. Like just the idea that you would have even Virgil. if we can just raise enough to hire him for like a month. one night, like even a, one like night, yeah, a week, a week. Uh, Next, you should take him to the Eddie Murphy Halloween. movie premiere. That's what you should do, Clark. Come on, man. You got he's bookable, one hundred percent. You can get him for a night. He follows you I around. What his rate is oh, it's got to be a five hundred. Yeah, two, two, two grand. To, to, maybe five hundred. Five hundred to fifteen hundred for the night. Yeah, the you night. have a flight, a hotel. We're not, ta- we're not talking. We're not talking about for services. <laughs> I don't know what he charges for that. Okay, to, yeah. here we go. Flight, hotel, flight, hotel. Uh, that, you have to take care I of that. that. This and conversation then, has gone out of <laughs> control. No, 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 this is My great. God! I, I think it. you should do this. Oh, hell's broken loose here! And I, I think that you, all of your red carpet, all of your step and repeat, all of that stuff, you'll have Virgil behind you, and then he'll he'll give money every once in a while. So you think? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You think I cover his flight and hotel? And then you got to pay a little bit. A little bit of fee and feed. You got to feed. Obviously, per diem food, sure. Fifteen hundred. But what are we talking about? Is pure fee five hundred to fifteen hundred? If he doesn't have to fight anybody, yeah. I'm at like I'm only at like twelve hundred bucks. This whole thing. Let's do it. Oh my god, this is do it, do it. Dude, Just, can I? Who would I play? I want to be involved in this somehow, but I don't know. I could be on. No, but on the step and repeat. Step, oh, that's you. funny. You should try to attack him on step and, and repeat, and, and, and then Virgil, Virgil should take him down. And make it a viral video, and you make your money. back. And you can get a million dollar belt. Those things are for sale. Yeah, she can get them for like five hundred bucks. I have a replica of the world heavyweight belt. Already. I mean, if no, you're gonna no, have Virgil, though, if you're gonna have Virgil, though, you gotta get the million dollar belt. By the way, and also you can't wear pants. You have to wear a jacket, no pants. Yeah, satin. Teddy DiBiase's Ted DiBiase's gimmick before Del Rio took it. <laughs> Should have been that since the economy is so bad, Teddy has to pawn the million dollar belt, and they show the like the million dollar man like on what like. At Pawn Stars, yeah, like at rough times. Do, do you remember? Do you remember when they uh, should do? They should. I mean, if they wanted to, like they try to do the Occupy Wall Street thing, sort of, yeah, sort of. They should do it with DiBiase. Like have Teddy have to pawn the belt. Do you remember when Jamie Noble was rich? That would involve them putting yeah. any degree. Jamie of faith. Noble was rich. Yeah, uh, in t- two thousand three, yeah. him and no, Nidia had money. They they made an eight hundred. They, their grandmother left them eight hundred twenty three thousand dollars, and the belt. He was gonna. I was trying to get him to belt, and I was told no, not for that little. <laughs> I'm like, I love Jamie Noble as the rich guy. He bought a fur coat for Nidia. He was like, but how oh, I do remember this yes. for Teddy. Like, what's that for DiBiase Jr. to do? Well, I got it's so, bad to do I got so excited. He, I don't think he no, but I go against it. I'd say that they're broke. The DiBiase fortune is squandered. <laughs> yeah, I don't know when he's like blue collar, uh, gruff. Well, he sort of got when there. Madoff happens he when they should like, yeah, the, the, the Madoff thing. Would he got worked. to like the DiBiase's had all their money with Madoff. He got that to like a great. nervous breakdown DiBiase character near the end of that. Yes. I was just so never so all of that is for, all of that is forgettable. By yes. the way, yes, yeah. yes, I know. a completely one hundred percent forgettable. You, you've pitched wrestler. more better creative than that, which is depressing. Because he's a great wrestler, and he's any, he any last-minute callers before we, we yeah. shuffle off this motorcycle. I think he's one of the more underrated guys they have. I agree. Yeah. Can't Please, find a girl. I can't find one girl. I love, I love, I love uh, that spot. No girls. No girls. I don't need girls. What's I have. I'm but happy with everyone. What about just a really cute guy? guy? I have fired? the trailer queued up. Oh, okay, great. Oh, Chronicle. Uh, yes, we're gonna show yes! the trailer to Chronicle. This is a movie I wrote. Um... There. That's a great lead. That's a good lead. That's the best lead ever. Uh, it's really cool. I can't wait to see you on talk shows. Yes. I, well, I'm right. not allowed to. I'm actually not allowed to reveal any details about well, it. You've you've just did that wonderfully. That's other, good. other than to say that even if this trailer seems like it shows a lot, it doesn't. Okay. Let's play. Enough, it. Let's play. Let's it. watch it. What'd you guys think of it? <laughs> oh, it's here. Oh, and our mics Ain't are about on, so. the money. Money. <laughs> Probably money. gonna want to get this on camera. Uh, I don't want to do it. Dude, I don't want to do it. Okay, are you ready? Okay, Come on, do it. Give me a countdown. I will, okay. I promise. Ah! <laughs> oh, <crap. laughs> are we rolling? I'm gonna get the gum. Pull it right out of his mouth. I got this one. Sweet, sweet. <laughs> <laughs> She's just looking at it. By the way, exactly what I do. My theory, though, is that it's like a muscle. Watch this. Dude, holy crap. That's why I think we're getting stronger, you know? It's, she thinks it's stolen. She has no she idea. Stolen. Yes, it was the black guy this time. Because <laughs> we're working it out. There's nothing stopping us. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, 
just some rare nigga. What the hell is this guy's problem? Was it an accident, Andrew? Andrew? I'm worried about Andrew. Listen to me. We can't screw Wait, around with this. It's too this dangerous. Andrew, it's what, not what a game. Andrew! Stop this right now! Yes, what is that? Alright, dude, we're going inside. Steve, wait up. Matt, look at this. Holy. Very cool. Ooh. I guess that looks really cool. Whoa, whoa. Looks yeah. very cool. Yeah, it is really cool. So wait, where's the, the time machine, the hot tub? <laughs> <laughs> That's what's in the bottom. Oh, it was. Oh, it was oh, not it was his out, movie. Yeah. I thought it was his. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, oh. fair enough. Yeah. Well, since I you can't now. talk about oh, it, that I was get, great. I get... Oh, I get Did you just chills. finish in your pants? Uh, I it always, does look really cool. Every, every time yeah, I get chills really cool. seeing it. American Akira. I, uh, you know what? It's 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 it, you'll you'll it's you'll see. I, I can't. You know, that, you again, know, they're, making, great, great they're making yeah. an Akira movie that's yeah, nothing you, like Akira. You beat them so. to it. I made it like way cooler looking. Yes. Thank you. Clark, I, uh, do you have your trailer? No, no, uh, no. There's none of you and Virgil on the step and repeat. Oh, yet? that's a, that's a that's a reality we'll show we can there. do. I can sell that in India. Yeah, <laughs> you and Virgil in India. <laughs> I can so sell great. that in India. What a great buddy cop movie. <laughs> exactly, yeah. It'd be really funny. Well, uh, cool. Well, by we the have, way, for, the, yes? for those on uh, listening on iTunes, you could check that uh, trailer out at YouTube. Yes, Just search Chronicle. Chronicle. There yes. you go. Yeah, yeah. Man. That was that was probably some good podcast listening yeah. right there. You want to? Uh, <laughs> oh, I know the visuals are so good. I feel like they have to watch it. Thank you. Those are visuals courtesy of co-creator of. Chronicle Josh Trank. It's very cool. Nice. Uh, do we want to do predictions? Yeah, you guys. So, are you going to watch the pay per view? Yeah, but I watch yeah, every we, pay per view. We're going to watch it together. I, mean, and I, I watch every. Prediction. This is our predictions. Oh, oh, dude, I thought we were getting abducted. No, nope. that's out in the parking lot. I, mean, I, 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 I watch all of them. Okay. I, I watched that last. Are you excited for Juggalo it? I pay per view the Roddy. Wait, you on. watched the Juggalo I pay per view? I want to make sure Roddy didn't die or something. Oh, it was, how was this? The Wait, match? hold on. Stop again. You watched the Juggalo Wrestling Federation? I went to Best Buy and bought a cable to hook my laptop up to my Just television. Just go buy a Roku. Oh, you are on. an amazing human. No, no, yeah. Clark's very, very real. Clark, here's a couple things. So, like, you're in movies <laughs> and stuff. Just, like, these are a couple things we should go over. You're in, like, a bunch of big movies. Like, you're very funny. Everybody recognizes you. Do you Handsome. think that there's a point in your life where you're just going to be like, I don't think I'm going to do this anymore? Watch wrestling? Yeah. No, I mean, but like, go get a cable for the Juggalo Federation. No, dude. Why? Why? Would, That's why, dope. No, I'm just why saying. Why would there be a point? Oh, I'm, I'm agreeing with you. I'm just. No, I want to hear it out. One of the. This is like the only thing I do watch. Well, I don't. Thank watch you for any putting like my TV fictitious show. children through college. That's very cool. Yeah, <laughs> yeah for me, cool. for me, yeah, it's I mean, this and Breaking Bad. I, I read. Oh. I, I go to the movies, and this is like I watch. I watch uh, Boardwalk Empire. Yeah, Boardwalk Empire is getting Boardwalk good Empire right now. Awesome. Well, we can stick around and review really, that. Really That's next. Yeah, yeah, I can talk, <laughs> I can talk about that at length too. Awesome. I like this last episode. Yeah. So, so are you gonna you're gonna watch it with him? Yeah, of course. And you're excited. Prediction wise, it. you know the mega powers are gonna break up. That's yeah. what we're thinking. It's, I don't care about that. You that, know, that, that doesn't matter. I'm we want to about, watch it. The, the most interesting thing. Ziggler, Zack Ryder is gonna steal the show. Well, and, you know what I'm excited about? That's in the garden. So Rock coming yeah. back yeah. to the garden where he debuted and where he had yeah. his last match. And yeah. that's is, a hot crowd always. Oh, it'll be really interesting. Yeah. Although there are about two thousand tickets on StubHub if you'd like to go. Wait, oh, what's really? the? Uh, what, I, don't, I have no idea like what the main event or anything. I don't. Well, the main event's the tag team. It's a tag team. That'll be the last match. Like what's that's the closing. And then Henry. It'll be Punk and Punk and. Punk and Del Rio, Rio and Henry and Big Show. Because that's thrilling. Does Punk win? Like, what uh, happens with that? I doubt they it. Haven't Punk figured does it out not yet. win. I have Punk no idea win. where that, because I don't know where you, that story goes at all. You know when you're going to be drunk next as compared to when they know when, what's happening with that title. <laughs> I, just, I just find the whole Punk versus Del Rio thing not interesting the way it's been booked. It's, and I, it's disappointing. No, the, the Be A Star stuff tonight was a little too much for my taste. I think it could be because both those guys are really good. It'll just, be interesting to see, but I mean, Punk's been so cooled off. I mean, he was... Uber cool 72 days ago or wherever it was. Yeah. I'm saying that number. Um, yeah, yeah I, I don't know if I'm going to watch it. I don't know if I'm going to be at that I'm point. Watching so. it. I am. I am because I like to Who watch Mark Henry? Who is Mark Henry? Probably the big show again. They, they blew up the ring. Maybe they can blow up the uh, entire Arena? building. Yeah. That'd be well, awesome. they, they, the building they, should burn down. Yeah. 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 They were doing a, a thing yeah. where they were like, 
if a ring can't hold them. What can? You know what I think? Put them on a boat. Punjabi <laughs> prison. <laughs> oh, bring back the Don't Punjabi. say that in front of Lagana. I'm taking the Punjabi prison with me to India. Well, that was Lagana's thing. No, it wasn't mine. It was Come on, that was put on you, though. Co- oh, yeah, I took Look it. at everyone ducking blame for the Punjabi you know they made a place <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I, I, I saw it at kids, Walmart. Kids should definitely play with, like, that yeah. torture. There's a set, prison. right? Yeah, yeah there's a, a prison. A there's a set based on that thing. I didn't get any more. If that had been, like, the X Division from TNA, like, three jumping years ago. Jumping off that stuff. <laughs> jumping off that yeah. stuff, that would have been, like, one of the and best matches Instead, they put Batista and Mark Henry and Kali in it. I miss Batista, by the way. Heal Batista at the end of the Oh, Dutch Batista was so much fun. In the He's just hanging around LA. He's borrowing him. rocks. Uh, rocks borrowing his arms, though. Yes. <laughs> that, had, that was one of my favorite leave ever. Him having the team uh, come in the wheelchair. Yes. I was like, that is a perfect. I miss him and character. Jericho a lot. Like, I awesome. miss Jericho. I miss yeah. Jericho every. But he's become weird on Twitter. He's like become like bitter in a way I, yeah. I don't like. I wow. can't really. Speak I miss to that fun anymore. Jericho. Oh yeah, I know. Well, we've fun ADD'd your evening long enough, people. Yeah, let's go. go be free. Sarah goodbyes. We'll say goodbye. Thank you. Guys have fun. I did. This was a lot of fun. Chronicle the movie. You can check that out. And on Twitter, what is your name? Up to my knees and on. YouTube, but my YouTube's really indulgent. What's your Twitter, Clark? It's just my name, Clark Duke, but I don't really... He doesn't do anything. I, I, I tweet do. constantly about nothing. I mean, and the movie uh, with like Eddie Murphy? A thousand words with uh, me and Eddie Murphy, but out in March. Awesome. Good well, deal. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. I won't be doing this for a while. Jensen will be filling in for me while I'm gone. Yeah, and you can follow me at JensenClan88 with a C. Yes. C-L-A-N-88. And I'm at Lagana. Yep. Hey, thank you me for... Uh, Max will be in the parking lot. Yeah, we'll be in the parking Next lot. Week. Waiting to get abducted. Thank you, guys. Thanks, guys. Take Talk care. Talk to you soon. This is really fun. Yeah, Let's eat the McRib now, guys. I'll get... From producers Kevin Undergaro and Phil Svitek, engineer DJ Jesse Janity, and the entire AfterBuzz TV staff, we would like to thank you for listening to the AfterBuzz TV network. If you have questions or comments, be sure to buzz us at info at AfterBuzzTV.com. And you can find us on Facebook or follow us on Twitter by searching for AfterBuzz TV. Buzz Buzz you later! Buzz you later! The views expressed herein are those of the host only and do not necessarily reflect the views of AfterBuzz TV or its owners or principals.